All right. Hmm. Okay. Get to it. Up the stairs. Now I can actually hear myself when I, uh... I'm doing this stuff. Alright, there we go. The enemy has reached us. So this is how my life's work ends. What? Rob? You fight on the side of the enemy? You invade your own homeland? Speeches. I didn't expect much from you. From yeah, I'm still shocked. Father, oh, you must surrender. You're the incarnation of bad luck. Please, Father, just lay down your weapons. After my, your mother gave birth to you, she fell ill. You brought this malady upon her. All she received from your birth after her demise were after well, it was her demise after five long years of suffering. You bear the guilt of the death of my beloved wife, and now you're to blame for mine. Do it. It's my mood. Let me go. I don't want to die in your arms. Till the end. Will you not show me any love? Love? I curse you with my last breath. You don't love me because I'm not your biological son. I know that. I'm the product of my mother's affair. Yes, I do not love you because you remind me of your mother's weakness every waking moment. I do not love you because your mother was sickened by your birth and eventually died. No, I'll be with her, my beloved Diana. And let me share this information with you. Mother did not die from, because of me or because she was sickened by childbirth. No, she revealed to me what she was suffering from. You let her great latest, you let her greatest love, my biological father, hang on the gallows. Mother died of a broken heart. You alone bear the blame. Yeah, that's right. You, you rotten! I, I. Later, loser. Rob, I'm sorry it turned out this way. I didn't expect any difference. Happy endings are for fairy tales only. Very good. Lord of Flandern is dead. No successor. Lord Rob Rearmeyer rules. Rob rules! And that means we have to kill you too. There was never any talk of that. Also, Rymeyer must die out. Are you on our side or not? We're not going to sacrifice Rob. Guess we won't be allies after all. Come on, men. Oh, good. Okay, well. I'm going to hit a lion dude with a, tire, a tiger punch. Anyway. <sighs> All right. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, sure. That's what we're doing.
Okay. Why? Got him. Before we finish this, before we lose any more of our honor. You would be of more use to me if you would live and regain your honor. You're lucky. I promised Lin in the Terminal Caves I would never hurt unarmed people that ever. I would never hurt unarmed people ever again. Sir Victor taught me the meaning of mercy, and while Sir Eagle instilled in me that we are all equal in flesh and blood, flaws included. In my head, I understand all that, but my heart still has to learn it. It took years to build the hatred in me, and it'll take years to undo it. Till I get there, I will listen to reason, and I'll listen to my friends. I'll surrender my title publicly in front of everyone. The house of Rearmire will be no more. Rob. But before that, I will release you from the crimes you committed as robbers. If you promise to do good again from here on, I'll even raise you back to the night wreck of night. Are you serious? I'm still the Lord of Flander, after all. Even though we rob people, even though we've been so heartless, you forgive us? Don't you question her, I'll change my mind. Life as robbers brought shame upon us and our families. What choice did we have? We needed to feed them. We would have done everything to escape this path. Attacking this castle was part of it. So was your death. If you're giving us the chance to escape this miserable life, we'll gladly take it. We'll reclaim our virtues. I swear, you have our gratitude. Quinn. I'll get some things done here first and come back to Hermitile afterwards. Understood. Happy endings are for fairy tales only, huh? Do I get anything from that? Oh, okay. I got another Grimoire Shard, too. Skills. Learn. Okay, I got two Grimoire Shards now. Good. Um, let's boost these stats. That's good.
Hmm, nice. What's high AI? 50% more hate per action gained. Okay, cool. Okay. Well, now I can go, um, what I'm going to do next, I'm going to wander around a bit. Get all the rest of the town, the folks I need to get. Hang on. Or in the world. I'm gonna bring all my all the folks to the new the the city. So we need to go to Rock Bottom. Hey Daphne. Yeah, almost done with this. Uh, well, we 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 kind of broke some chains, but uh, we're still we're still dealing with this. Oh, let's pick up this, uh, never his wife to begin with. Is he eating properly? Someone should be taking care of his health. Worried? Me? About him? <laughs> what nonsense. I, I tell, I feel I need a small vacation. Do you mind if I take a look at your, at your base? I want to get out of this dump here. Yeah? You're really taking me with you? Wow, you'll let anyone talk you into anything. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> all right, all right. Yeah, I'm, it's coming to the end, though. It's like, uh, I don't know, I think two more main quests left. A bunch of side stuff to pick up, though. And I, because I'm kind of going through and looking for all these. Blah, 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 blah. Here we go. All these auxiliary characters to uh, help build my new hideout. Ah, we go, we go, go to the beach. I thought there was a shopkeeper here, but I guess not. Dude, I took your advice. I'm doing this vacation stuff. Very quiet, and I have my peace here. Maybe a little too quiet. Ah. Can't do it. I'm not made for just lying around. Full of energy. I need work. Glenn, you can support, right? Take me in and I'll help you with your base. What do you say? Yeah, exactly. I have an airship and mech suits. Great. Did you hear that, Peggy? Hamlet? Truffle? We're heading for changing islands. Time for more productivity. Alright. So. Who's next? Who's next? Hmm. Okay. Got all my auxiliary characters too. Yeah, because I picked up Raphael from the uh, from the from the uh, the crew that used to run with the the church, and uh, I also picked up oh, who else I get? I got the bird person. I got uh, the random magic person that also has playing cards, where all their uh, attacks are completely RNG based on uh, dice rolls. Or the effects are RNG based on dice rolls. Where is... Uh, 
going to the uh, caves down here, I guess. Also, more gemstones. Crystal rocks over here that I can mine from? I don't think so. I still don't know how to get to this gold chest here. Yeah, I, I, the sprite work is really good in this. Like, I'm annoyed by some things about this game, like the... I guess the writing and... The character overshare and the way that the plot feels like like it becomes word salad towards the end. A lot of things, but they nailed it on a lot of stuff with as far as like well, and the fact that it's pretty much a a square soft tribute act, um, <laughs> unashamedly. But they nailed it on so many other fronts that it's like hard to say mad at the whole thing. Okay. Why don't I have stone powers? Oh well. There we go. Oh yeah, I should be able to warp around here. Um... I still don't know how to get to, through that door yet, but oh well. Yeah. Maybe it's this way. Nope. Oh, I know which way I'm going. Ah, the Goblin Village. Can select all here. Okay, good. I didn't even notice that option. Like sometimes I'll like start playing a game and just completely forget to read the thing on a menu. I don't want to get rid of meals.
What a charming theme song. Get rid of snacks, though. There we go. Oh, that's not that much. Okay, key items. The human language. Okay, sure. <laughs> Husband went up to the surface and got and didn't return. I'm worried some filthy humans got him. I'm wondering if maybe one of these. That's right, we beat up their boss. <laughs> okay. Oh, God. Wonderful. Let's drink goblin pee. This is Goblin Village. Now that I know what that is, I'm not drinking it again. <laughs> oh my gosh. Where is it? Hold on a second. Is it this way and then down? Yeah, it is. Item. There we go. Now I can start working my way through this. Oh, hello. I'd like to pray that the heroes of. I do have sacred water, though. Guess not. Sacred water, but I guess I don't. There we go. There we go. You can do this. Yes. Reach you, Adventures of Landis. Good. Oh, 
It's a good thing I bought a bunch of these. Excellent. Didn't use any skills at all, but sure. That, mm. Mage Warrior. What I needed. Essentially got a spell sword. Oh, hello. Why are you interrupting my training? Wait, are you the Crimson Wings? You're still pretty green behind the ears. If you're fi fighting for the good of Belendis, you better train harder. Since my training has been interrupted here anyway, I'll help you. Let me be your trainer. Oh, nice. Initial SP from every battle with a chance of 50%. Okay. Sure. I'm wondering if, if this, this passageway leads me to the item I've been winning. We got three more. It'll be cool if so. Worms. That's travel location found. Looks like an item would fit in here. Well, 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 well. East. Okay. The I don't know how. Hmm. What is this location called anyway? Your woods. That's interesting. There. Where would that go? Where would it be? Two treasure chests around here. Oh. Nice.
that's going on south and ah. Not bad. Still wondering about treasure chests in that, uh, this area there. Figure it out at some point. Hmm. Okay. New sword. Okay, that's I've talked to somebody about that. Hello. the door with the church key. Not sure what is the deal here. Uh hit the switch. This is new. Find the hidden stone tablets in Volandis, the help of Leonor in the forest in the west, in the east, finally mountains. It's for the most part uh, it's for the most part a legible. With some time the party is able to figure out three locations in Volandis. Yeah. That's a weird riddle. Not even gonna be bother be bothering with this part of the uh, quest because it seems like it's sort of an optional thing at this point. But uh, that's gonna be something for post game or new game plus, whatever, whatever it is. Okay, so Zellor. That's a new person. Hmm. Back to your woods. Did it? The way's clear. Now to new shores. Your clan? You don't have much use for do you have much use for a lumberjack? Well I work well and I don't charge much. Really? Great. To my new employer, the Crimson Wings. Cool. Should be about time for uh oh, and we've got a treasure chest saw that too. Rusty gun.
What's next? I have everybody. Might. I might have absolutely everybody now. I think that's it. Let me go back to, uh... There's a hermit's isle. Almost everybody on my list. What are you doing here? Maybe I need to do this. Just a little vacation. Certainly not here because of you. So you dug up some far? You're a disgrace to our ex family. God forbid, you just arrived and my blood pressure is already rising. Definitely not because of me. You're probably just feeding out garbage again. We used to have a strict diet at home that included intermittent. Uh, we used to have a strict diet that included intermittent fasting at home. We fasted because your food was disgusting. Not even the hungriest yak would touch it. That's why you rise like a yeast lump. The other clan members are probably getting fatter and fatter as well. You help me out here. Somebody t has to take care of your health. What? You want to stay here? No problem with it? Ah. Oh, okay. Jeez. Good. Alright, where is... Elixir. There we go, finally, level four. Who would have thought that one day we'd rake our own cattle on this island? Ambassador from the Entree. I think the Prince of Rings will be an important political figure in Valandis' future. These offices are important if we can invite foreign diplomats. The Crimson Wings are slowly becoming more than a clan or a resistance group. We're not outside of Valandis. Cool. You can sign the contract. The Crimson Rings will get provi provisions from the free cities. That works for me. That these are the most amazing invention of our time. Okay. How do you like the results? We're even fortified against enemy attacks. Cool. Look at my office. Quite nice, isn't it? I'm making good money with all the sky armors you break. I've never broken a sky armor, not even once. Look at all these buildings. The island is coming along very strong. It's really coming along. It'll be hard for me to leave Valandis after we have finished mapping all these lands out. Hmm. Oh, 
<laughs> wow, mean. What do you think? It's a nice place to relax. Yeah, I might have done it with, overdone it with all the animals. I'm wondering why I didn't pick up a goblin recruit. Also. Nice. Nice. So, it doesn't appear as though there's much to mine here, but looks to be deceptive. I promise you that old bird will find something valuable in this place. Nice! Two solar furnaces. Oh, good. Good, good, good. Now I need to, um... My dear Slim, I hope you through that you are well. Melia has been taking good care of the injured so far. Her healing powers are first class. Now I want to take care of the clan's winter well-being. I believe the interior of this, uh, our base hasn't been built up totally yet. Um, make one here already? No. Okay. Okay, so if I talk to that person, then um, then I'll only get certain kinds of crystals from a mine. Just, the beds are in this area are mainly for foreign guests. We've really come far. Everyone helps the Crimson Wings in their own way. I might be no big help on the battlefield, but boy! Yeah, it's alright! Can I clean bed sheets? I'm basically just seeing it out to the end. It's it's good, but uh, even though there's you know issues with that I have with you know some of the writing and some of the other things, but uh, but I really like I like it. It's still behind. Uh, it's still behind uh, Crystal Project as far as how much I like it, but. Um, yeah, it's a fun game, still. What are you doing, by the way? Ooh, ooh, we got some stuff. Some more stuff. Plot armor. Knightly sword. Light thread. This is a place worthy of your best equipment. This place is nicer than, much nicer than the cave. Okay, cool. Move from weapon. Uh, 
All right, let me do some things here. Not even sword. Silver Bolero. That's... Let's remove what we don't need to use anymore. Remove gems from the ones that we don't. I'll combine. Habits. I don't think I'm going to get uh, these two guys back, unfortunately. Would have been nice. But they're not coming back. I'll leave the weapons on them because, um, because it's not really a thing that matters at this point. Uh, Some toxic resistance might be worthwhile. You know what? Honestly, both of these resistance ones might be worthwhile. Let's see what we got here. Really, no weapons. Surprise.
There we go. Ah. All right, let's combine some gems. I'm a master. Ah, uh, no charges. Pistol master. Sword master five. attack. There we go. Good hit. strike light attack Strike. Be strike. Resistance. Kind of mind up. I'll take that. Violence resistance. resistance there we go Ooh. 
Back up is not available. Should have used that one, that's okay. So, uh, attack up seven. sell leftover crystals but I can't it makes sense at least Gun? I thought I had Gun Master, but I guess not. Alright, oh, I can use the Great Sword Crystal. Or something that. So we attack up and then Great uh, Sword Master 3. Good. Look at care of that. What else we got? Dark Attack. No, I don't want to use Dark Attack 3. In any case. For top knot, uh, or barefoot top knot. I don't know why I can't keep reading that wrong, but uh, your name rather. Um, <laughs> it's okay, everyone does. <laughs> uh, this is pretty good. This is uh, this is like, I'm glad I'm not alone in that too. Uh, but yeah, I'm doing, I'm doing alright. I'm, uh, playing, uh, let's see here. Yeah, Chain Echoes is, uh, almost done, honestly. Um, I might be leaving some stuff for the post-game or New Game Plus whenever I get back to it. But. But. Wait, what is that? What's that? There are all these... These new locations just popped up on my map. I'm really curious about where they, where they lead to, but uh, there was this new side quest about tablets and oh no. 
Oh no, it's this. It's these puzzles. These puzzles. But, yeah, I think I'm gonna save that aspect of this until later. But, uh, yeah, this game is going great. It's, um, it's got some things about the forest storyline and everything that, um, you know, I kind of wish they would have sort of, you know, actually uh, wrote a little better and a bit of the character development I wish they wrote a little better, but the combat mechanics and a lot of the quests and sort of the way that the way that the adventure plays out in towards the end is really cool um and the actual the actual physical act of the world building is really cool so i mean it, you know it's it's one of those things that's it's one of those games that's easy to recommend um especially if you like the sort of mid late 90s square soft games or uh, even Suikoden, uh, it bears a lot of resemblance to that, but especially if you like, like, Chrono Trigger, Final Fantasy VI, uh, even Xenogears, uh, it reaches into that. Um, but, yeah, it's really good. Yeah. I mean, honestly, this game is, you know, it's, it's got this middle section, it's got sort of a middle section near the end section that's kind of uh, bogged down with a lot of tropes, but at the same time, it's, it's alright. It's, it's charming in its own way, and I don't know what this is. Is this just, I can revisit this uh, location? Oh, no, I can go around this map. Oh, hello. <laughs> um, this was a surprise. I'm guessing that I was going to have to do this anyway at some point. <laughs> but, uh... Yeah, I'll tell you, another game I'm working on, though, is uh, Crystal Project. And... It's not... It doesn't have as much of a... Uh... It doesn't have so much of the... Uh, the Sort of the huge... Um... Yeah, so the huge overarching plot that uh, that this does, but I think some aspects of the world design come off a little better. Uh, and I'm going to be getting back to Crystal Project right after I finish this game. Yeah, I'll show you in a minute. In case you're not familiar with Crystal Project, let me get the link for that. But now this is the other game that I'm working on right now, and it's a little more, it's a little looser, and a little like more non-linear. You have a big open world; you can do things in any order. Uh, there's kind of some platforming aspects to it as well, um, but I really like it, and. Um, I really like sort of the, you know, make your own sort of path aspects of that. Um, so it flows a, little, a lot differently from, from this. But, um, yeah, it's it's one I'm really excited to get back to. Hmm, I think we're getting messed up here. Yeah. No, it's a it's a like I said, a different kind of a different flavor of game than than this overall. Um but there's a lot that I like about it more. Let me see here. Can we bounce back here?
Oh, no wonder. Yeah, yeah. I don't think this is going to go... I want it to... Yeah... case. At least now I can kind of start properly. <laughs> I'm not sure it, whatever the uh, octopus is. Whatever it is. It's a uh, it's messing me up. Big time. I think. Hmm. Maybe yeah, I just have to poison it. Perfect for Tom now, thank you for the 50 bits. I do appreciate it. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Alright, hold on. We gotta go back on this. Let's see here. Um maybe light shots. <laughs> Oh. Yeah, I'm still in counter stance. This. We can't poison the rest of these. Ooh, that's a lot of poison damage. And that's also a lot of damage. <laughs> all right, all right, yeah. Oh, no. Air kit DX. Good. Okay, let's see here. Exchange parts. Oh. That's not good. Wind. Okay, so regular 
Elixirs work just as well. Poison Salvo. Kills. We need better everything. We need better everything. Okay. Uh, load auto save. Not going to worry about that just yet. down to the space here the models and tell me which one you like don't forget don't forget buying these airships is something cosmetic don't expect a different experience oh okay Gonguri is a scouting vessel. It's small in order to stay, save their pet and save energy. Okay. Translates to acorn in the common language. Good. Well, what was... What was out here? That's a good looking airship. The Cardinal is the biggest airship you can buy as a private person. And Volandis. Series is the perfect all rounder when it comes to speed, consumption, energy consumption, mobility, and capacity. Carnival is most famous for its reliability. Okay. I am surprised. Oh, no, absolutely not. Absolutely cannot afford to buy an airship. For the, let's just see if it on the food. Biabe is really base spell. I mean, how to pronounce it? Why did I say spell? Felt like you're reading my words, right? Look, chef, I can feel you on this. I mess up my words all the time. Spelling and pronunciation. What 
What's up? Can't you see I'm busy? Alright. Okay. First of all... the other what other jobs do I have? I have the rune knight and the gambler and the pyromancer Okay, so the last the last three jobs are completely elected. Okay. Well, enough of the optional stuff. We'll get back to that in post-game or new game plus. Or whatever you want to call it. Got to go to Romanus Tower. Hey, Gustav, join us. I love the king and would follow him anywhere, but this is going too far. I don't care for the rebels, but our families are there. And the rebels make no pretense of giving up. We th we were once seven generals. Now we are only but three. I mean, I don't feel like laughing anymore. You don't agree with his decisions as well. I heard it in your voice. It's one thing to kill the enemy, but... Our own family's in Tormund? Why are you doing this? I'm sorry if I appeared like I would disagree with his majesty. We're soldiers of the king. His word is our command. He took his words tell the murderer of our countrymen. Completely crazy. Trust the king. Kinrick! Oh, that's what it's come down to. My children and grandchildren are in the palace. The king is not going to take them away from me. Don't you dare. Touch the king. Your loyalty will be remembered fondly. <laughs> um, Alina, we're going to do it now. There's no turning back now. Wow. Your Highness, word has reached us. The enemy is at the foot of the tower. There are about a hundred men. Hundred? I wonder, are they bold or foolish? Send our soldiers down to take care of them. Yes, sir! Oh, excuse me, Sir Kenrick. Your sword. It's soaked in blood. Get lost, lad. You didn't see anything. Yes, sir! What's the meaning of this? King, how many times have we tried to persuade you? Why didn't you heed our advice? You raised your sword against me? Against the, against the king you swore allegiance to? 
My oath is yours, but my love belongs to my family. I had to wait both. The result is me standing here with this sword. But still. Lay down your weapons, generals. You hate me for planning to kill our countrymen. Yet whose blood is it that stains your blade right now? You have no reason to, or no right to, for your demands. Don't think that I will surrender. You were given too great a burden at such a young age. Yeah. Let me lighten it. Magic. It doesn't work. I not do anything either. You really think I'm stupid, don't you? I think I gave you the power of the Grimoire without claiming it for myself. I may not be able to wield an element as, as a weapon such as you, but I've been given a very special power. Think of the power of a sovereign. I can seal magic all around me. Damn you. You're nothing but the devil in men's flesh. Your father was lucky to have passed away before he knew your true colors. Rest assured, my dear general. <laughs> you will see your family soon enough. Yeah, this is, uh, general. What is this dark magic? This is old true magic, general. Even the king can't seal it. End it, wine. Yes, your majesty. No, wait. Ah! Well, rip to them. So, uh, yeah, we're, uh, I decided to not bother with the optional, uh, octopus kraken boss because, uh, it's, it's optional. It's optional. I can do that later. Merlin. By the way, we're getting better sky armor anyway, so. What's. Let's see here. This, that's down an attack. I mean, it's it's not a bad one to start with. It's a pretty good one to start with. Um, not... after so many years, I I sort of dropped out of the out of really enjoying it just because I got very burnt out on a lot of the con a lot of the conversation around it. But it's a good one, and I also kind of got burnt out on the act on the actual. Uh, mechanical aspects of it, but it's a good game. My first was Dragon Quest. Or Dragon Warrior, I, I, I guess now. As it was. What is that? Okay, wind shot. Oh, no, actually, no. My first one... My very first RPG was Ultima 3 Exodus on the NES. On the N -N 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 NES. I played that before I played Dragon Warrior. I think I played that before I played Dragon Warrior. There we go. There we go. 
Let me see when this when when Ultima 3 came out. Oh yeah, the PC version came out in 1983. Oh yeah, those were good too. February 1989. Dragon Warrior was August 89, so yeah, it would have been it would have been Ultima 3 first. Amazing how long some guess some games were made when you research the release it. Yeah. Uh I say this is the oldest building in Velandes. For what purpose was it built? Not known. No one actually no one usually ventures here because it's swarming with the ancient guardians. They always seem to they seem to have already been driven away by Tarin. But the lower levels are still crawling with them. Supposedly, the tower grows as deep underground as it, does, as it is tall. Well. Sword and Shield 400. But yeah, the, um... The NES had some really good RPGs even before Dragon Warrior came over. I mean, that was sort of, you know, seen as popularizing it in the, uh, or seen as, like, you know, making it popular on consoles in the U.S., but there were a few of them. There we go. Yeah, the computers were where it was all at, as far as RPGs go. I didn't have a computer until, um, 1991 is when I got my computer. And, uh, cause, but I wanted, I tell you, I wanted like a, uh, like a Commodore or an, or an Amiga 500. Just any of those would have been great. Uh, to have before the, uh, before I got my PC. I did. I mean, the Commodore was cheap by the time that I wanted it, because they had already dropped down to $99, but, um, but yeah, the Amiga was up there. Expensive drones. Switch to Merlin. Yeah, the Amiga had a was pretty much the one that you had to upgrade a lot. Um, hmm. Really get a lot out of, but um, uh, four element resist, status resist. SP up. Two times additional SP in the camera. Okay. Oh, oh, oh.
Hmm. And shield 400. Yeah. Oof. Oh, that's that's awesome. Gosh, yeah, this was that was probably the H1200 was like right when they were sort of going away in in the states because they kind of yeah they they but oh that would have been a nice machine to have though even with uh you know less uh, less uh even with them starting to fall behind a bit um in terms of um uh, well it's like in all kinds of internal strife as well right um with things that uh things like the uh i guess issues with, with with management and sort of uh things like that which yeah that's and then that's what almost sank uh i was like that's what almost sank apple back in the 90s back when they were uh just before steve jobs came back so yeah oof There we go. Here's here's what I needed. <laughs> Amiga means girlfriend. You think in Spanish? Yeah. Right, right, right. No, I. It was it was kind of a niche item in the US uh, but I still really wanted one like just because I like the aesthetics of the of like the the, the games and just lots of things about it were just so much cooler than than most of the stuff that you could get on PC at the time yeah I mean and then in Europe, I know it was just gigantic, especially, especially in like Germany. It was just a huge computer. Yeah. Yeah, Germany and England was, were really, really prop that uh, prop the machine up for a while. do this right then I guess um you, you see you use the mode of dial up to ring German bulletin board systems after midnight if it's cheaper hmm nice In other places for zero day set yeah Sixteen for over seven hundred dollars because you were ringing them with dollar. Oh, yeah, that's no good. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh. 
Oh my gosh. Yeah, I could. <laughs> I can see that how that would uh, kind of upset the uh, household there. <laughs> There we go. Where in the world? I don't want to climb the elevator just yet. My favorite system growing up it was the it was the Super NES. Um largely because of the RP largely because that's where my head just got expanded because of RPGs. go yeah it was a good version of Street Fighter I and um th there were a lot of really good arcade versions of games on the on the uh, SNES but um Took a while for them for, for them to catch up to certain other things, especially like sixty-eight thousand based things were always done better on like the the Genesis, the Mega Drive. Um largely because of the architecture similarity and things like that, but also um it was just an easier machine to program for as well. Um But, um, yeah, yeah, yeah. They had the, they had the market in the, yeah, Sega had the market in, especially in, in Europe and Australia, but Nintendo, Nintendo caught them pretty handily and, uh, in Japan and America. Like Mortal Kombat my swung the swung the uh you know the balance for a while. Um but then after like Super Metroid and you know a lot of the other RPGs they really just it just really took off. Let's see, did I... I don't have to do anything with the sky armor, do I? I mean, I'm not really a, I'm not really a fan of Donkey Kong Country, but it has its place as well. It's, uh, it really, uh... It really showed up as a, uh, as a big... Big mover for, uh... For the, um... For the Super NES. There's the other one. That's what I was looking for. Yeah, it did. It did. I'm not going to deny that. I'm just not really a big fan of the, uh... Just not really a big fan of the, uh, the mechanics of that one, I guess. And then Killer Instinct came along, and, and it was... That was... That moved a lot. And also, uh, the Super Nintendo version, the, the Super Nintendo version of Doom did really well as well. And like, arguably the, um, the best console version of Doom ended up being the 32X one. But the 32X was also 
didn't. Um, it wasn't Killer Instinct wasn't on Amiga. That was uh that was a, a Super N Super NES original. Are you talking about like a re like a uh, fan remake or whatever? By the way, we're on an elevator. Oh, okay. So it was like a fan port. Got it. Hmm. Come on, Chris. Watch out. Eight floppy disks? Wow. Don't save your life. Where are you? Do not stand in our way. Do not lose ourselves in empty arguments. <laughs> To kill you and nothing will change that. On guard. No. Water. Yeah, I mean, there's, um, like I said, there's a lot of good stuff about all the platforms. Um, there's stuff on just about every, every major console platform that I like. Um, uh, so, yeah, yeah. Oh, this is not good. Um... I, you know what? I said almost. <laughs> I I wasn't an N64 person, unfortunately. Um, largely because I was so into, yeah, largely because of the RPG thing again. Like they didn't have anything for me that, uh, as far as RPGs go, and that was really unfortunate. Um, let's see here. Mirror image. Yeah, I didn't even... Um, I'll tell you, the first RPG that I really... The, the first game that I really got super into uh, on the N64 was a wrestling game. It was, um, WCW NWO Revenge. And, um... Why am I so in the red here? It's I'm in the red because I, I messed up completely. I wasn't paying attention. There we go. I need to... Our commander, we looked up to you. How could you betray us? I've been true to myself back then, and I still am. If only you, if you would only believe in me, you would understand there is no betrayal. There we go. Oh, come on.
Finally. Um, this is Oh, I hate mirror images. Okay. Wasted, wasted. Uh, Dungeons and Dragons? Some stuff in Dungeons and Dragons. Then I laid my hands on the ears of my heart so I would not hear of your betrayal. Um my first my first tabletop game though. Um my first tabletop games um were Marvel Superheroes by TSR. Um Star Wars, the um the first Star Wars game, and Shadowrun. So like most of my early RPG experience wasn't even shaped by D&D, uh, &D, even though I liked the computer games after I picked up a after, after I got my my PC. Like I liked uh, I liked the the gold box games and I had the Beholder. Um, when I got into when I got into tabletop games for the first time, I didn't even like I didn't even touch that system, so you know it was like. It's always been sort of, you know, I've seen, I've seen other things already, so I, I kind of have a different perspective, I guess, I guess. Um, and I'm a little more open to trying out other RPGs as well. But, um, like Deadlands was a really good one too. First edition Deadlands, um, was fantastic. And, um, also GURPS, and, uh, I really like that a lot. I like, um... I don't know if you're you're familiar with the Cypher system or Numenera, but that's a really awesome system uh, from modern times. Um, yeah, that's it's a really good system. It's when people are looking for like a a and D alternative that is uh, that has just as much like you know crunch and just as much you know just as much uh you know things going on with it that that does but without being too crunchy like like uh pathfinder can be and i bet i love pathfinder as well and i like starfinder a whole lot um numenera and especially other cypher system, system games like the strange and um you know cypher multiverse and things like that i always point to those really good system uh but, but you've gone too far this time. <laughs> Your betrayal screams too loud for me not to hear. Forgive me, Berea, but I had to do it. Forgive an enemy is an easy thing. To forgive a friend, it's not. Dang. How many, dra How many deaths have you dragged into your bloody game, Frederick? That was a tough fight. <laughs> Oh my gosh, that was a rough fight. Ooh.
see here. Hang on. Ah, I might be able to finish this tonight. For this morning. Depending on your viewpoint. <laughs> Let's see here. Can I get some more points in here? Magic. There we go. Three points. At some point, I would love to do uh, tabletop campaigns on the stream, but uh, there are people. There are so many people that do do that better than I would that. Um, I wouldn't even know where to begin, honestly. Magic. Okay. Do I have... You know what? I'm gonna do this. Yeah, right, right, right. Yeah, I'm just not, I, it, it's not so much that uh, I'm a novice, is that I just uh, wouldn't really have, a, I, I, I'd be bad at organizing it. There we go, there we go. Four. Rogode Beasting Piercing Shot All Cure There we go, there we go. Three. Yeah, I'd be too much of a pushover. <laughs> That's my problem. All right. Let me add some of these attacks. Yeah, I would give my players all, all sorts of cheats or, or sort of, you know, shortcuts or whatever. I wouldn't have the heart to uh, mess them up so much. Hmm. Wow, I'm... Let's see here. All right.
Time to do scary things. There he is. Strange. No soldiers around. Frederick, we're here to put an end to all of this. Your plan will fail. Our plan is already finished. It's a complete success, Celestia. What are you talking about? Former Princess Celestia, the Crimson Wings Lodestar, will kill the cruel King Frederick. Your people, your people will carry this story to all the corners of Atlantis. Everywhere. <laughs> yeah, well thank you for hanging out. Everywhere this news will be celebrated. By the people of Tauron, Vascania, and of Gravos. There will be celebrations for days. You, perhaps Princess Amalia there by his side, will take the lead. You will maintain a united kingdom. The hatred between the countries will not be gone. They'll be more willing to work together. Are you saying you purposely brought all this hatred up on your, onto yourself? Stop playing games with me. Rip Frederick. There is no other way for true peace. The end of an ordinary war would have a winner and loser. Now Volandis will win as a whole against its tyrant. Dwayne is upstairs with the grimoire. Make sure he doesn't use it again. You fool! It's getting so cold, Celestia. Every single night I dream I'm in a cave. Because I'm the only one. The one with the torch. Hundreds of people follow me. They built up this giant conflict and this is how it happens. They press down on me and push me forward. Even though I'm carrying a torch, I can see anything. They push me, step by step. And with each step, I'm afraid. I'm afraid of falling into a wooden abyss. I hope these dreams are over. Celestia, forgive me. I could draw the hatred of the entire world. That did not affect me so much. Sure hate. It hurts. brother did he hope I would forgive him just because he did all these gruesome acts for them for a just shot a just cause redemption cannot be claimed beforehand my brother has done terrible things and I'll never forgive him no one should no matter what his motivation was he should go down in history as the tyrant he was but at least in a small part in my heart I'll remember him as my brother Let's head upstairs. Well. King is dead and his people, to all appearances, are saved from a tyrant. Thou, that is, because the main problem remains. We must kill the vine. Not palaver. Not palaver. Hand over the stone. Today is a good day to take some risks. Would don't you agree, my beloved June? Totally agree. You know, there's a reason I never used the stone myself. The Viking can fall through it. They would detect the thief immediately. What are you doing? My feathers are quivering. Darn thieves touched the stone. He knew what to expect when touching it, and did it anyway. Is he making fun of us? You shall meet your death, thief. We summon him. Our champion. Hey. On the horizon. Oh, good. Lobos. Oh no. <laughs> what? What? What a hard little. Oh, okay. That's just horrid.
giant. It's moving towards the land. Oh my, I must have really angered them. Well, catch. Stone doesn't have enough power to kill a vine, but it will do for this minion. If you absorb its ether, you should have enough power to even kill its master. You want us to kill it? You could let it live, of course. Then you'd have to clean up the wreckage it'll leave behind on Volandis. You... Why does Volandis have to suffer like this? When is it all going to end? Is it... We'll make it in, Lynn. As long as we keep dreaming of a free Volandis, we can change the future. As long as we dream, there's hope. Volandis is a graveyard of hope. No. Volandis is the peaceful garden you were dreaming of. A garden that's destroyed over and over. Every flower cut. The grass black as coal. Lynn, even if all the flowers are burnt, spring will still come. But... I'm reluctant to play along to Gwen Gwen's fiddle, but we'll stop this monster. With the Grand Grimoire, Grand Grimoire for all I care. We're being chased around by tyrants and false gods. We're crawling through the mud of dirt and blood, only to be pushed down again and again from above. This has to end. We'll use the Grand Grimoire as a weapon. Reason, however, will be of the hand that wields it. And the well-being of all of every individual in Volandis will be the ground from which we attack. Well-being of all. We will no longer be passive bystanders. We will defend Volandis. You're right. Finish the champion of the, we'll finish off the champion of the vein. Well spoken, Glenn. We should be able to call Haku and the Himmelskaiser from here. Put the word out to all flight units. We are killing this giant. Well, let's have a fight. Vane be cursed. Look at this flock of monsters protecting their champion. Good. We have protection ourselves. Everyone is giving their best. Together we will defend Volandis. Be careful. An enormous beast is approaching. This thing is massive. It's another obstacle we'll defeat. Engage everyone. What? There we go. Hmm. 
No! Uh, uh soft locked? Come on, come on. the world? Salt locked. Um, well done. Yeah, we're stuck. We can't get out of this. Anyway, I'm gonna reboot this, this, this game back up. Uh, that stinks. All right, back to it. And we did just save outside of the thing, so, uh... Yeah, that's okay, okay. Okay. Let's go for it. Gosh, I'm hoping this this doesn't. Wah. Okay, quick repair on me dark shot. Yeah, quick repair on Sienna. Mm. 
Okay. Okay. Very good. Wind? Wind shot? Yeah. Adam. This is your chance, Glenn. Use the Grand Grimoire. The third time I have held this stone. This time, I will not hesitate. You did it! Alandis is saved? Are you alright, Glenn? Never been. You fools. What have you done? We only wanted to punish the thief. But with this, you've sealed the fate of all Valandis. There. Impossible. Uh, what is this? Quite a big fireball. The vein summoned it? Only out of mercy to the people did we not directly summon this orb of fire. But now the thief and you, his collaborators, have signed your death sentence. We will bestow judgment upon Valandis. Do you really think that we'll surrender? We have the means to defeat you. Look. Is this the giant's ether? How is this visible? Grimoire is absorbing the champion's ether. Your schemes will come to an end. Schemes? Ow. You humans need someone to lead. Look at your little troop. You follow after everyone blindly and in good faith. The churches, Marcus, the thief. You believed them all and were betrayed. But with the right leadership, this would not happen. Let me guess. You would be the perfect leaders. Ferris, your sarcasm. Do you really think of the world in such a black and white manner? The church saves people's lives. They find cures for diseases, drive hunger out of the world. Every single human life is important to them. Are they truly white? We destroy this world every few centuries. We wipe people off the face of this planet. Are we truly black? We understand that- whoa. We understand that you think we are the devil incarnate. We understand why humanity loves the church. But the truth is not so simple. We're stereo still your allies. Everything we do, we do not out of self-interest. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Be gone, false gods. They truly love their speeches. 
soon they will have nothing more to tell. Who are you? I am an ambassador who will invite you to the final battle. The Grand Grimoire is now strong enough. The key to the vine is in your hand. Now, Mr. Gwen awaits you at the appropriate door. So Gwen wants us to finish all this? How dare he think he can command us? You should be grateful to him. Look above you. If not for my master, the massive ball of fire would have in the sky would have already crushed Volandis. He is sacrificing the remainder of his life to slow it down. But still, Volandis's days are numbered. Who are you anyway? Show us your face. Gladly. What? My body is already buried. But with this armor, I now have a second chance. Wait, I recognize this voice. That took a surprisingly long time. Killian! That's Killian? What happened? Let me guess. What's it to you? Concentrate on what's important. Master Gwen and I are waiting for you at the door. It is located in the heart of this land, in the center of the former Magic Academy of Nisa. Down the puppeteer. Come and finish the vine. Killian! Finally, we, get the, we wrap that up. This, this worldly tyranny has come to an end. The gods are still sitting on their mortal throne. Let us act. All right, now we get to attack in the throne gods. Final battle has come. We kill the vein and destroy this inferno in the sky. And peace will finally return. A true peace in all the landis. Fortunately, all this is still a dream. The moment the fireball is still raging is raging over our heads. I don't think I have. I quite have. I don't quite think I have time to take a siesta. Sienna's right. We have to act. We are headed for Madeline. Maybe she has opened the gate to Nisa. Battle awaits everyone. Make your preparations. Sir Glenn, King Frederick is dead and Tarn stays without a sovereign. But the Terran soldiers are around Terranian soldiers around the round, round around the land won't yield so easily yet. But no reasoning if we meet them in battle. I understand, Farron. Thank you. Wow, the night sky. Not a fireball in sight. What are you doing here this late? Ben, are you okay? Yes, everything is fine. You're doing it again. I'm shutting everyone out. Do I do this often? Not so. I'm still trying to sort out my memories. The deeper I get, the greater my responsibility feels. I'm one of the oldest lions, you know. I lived my first life thousands of years ago. I saw the Harbinger rage over Eldria, and how the veins sealed it. Those images are if they're from a dream. A nightmare. Since time immemorial, I've had so many dreams. So many memories. Beautiful dreams and nightmares alike. All the people in these dreams. The ones I've loved, the ones I've hated, they're all gone. I've lost so much. Yeah, I need to go forward. I must not stop. The mission must continue. The church sees me as a saint. The Leonor Order is a special maiden. This is... I understand. Because of this, you think you're different from us. That's why you constantly try to carry the burden alone. Solve problems by yourself. What do you mean by that? You sacrifice yourself so that others will suffer. You overestimate me. Have you forgotten already? When we feed, when we feed Kindred, you volunteered fear you volunteered to give yourself up to your brother so he would let us live. I remember. I also remember that it didn't work and you almost died on the Aurora. Don't get me wrong, I meant it as a compliment. You need to stop trying to do everything on your own. Our opponents are beings who have the powers of gods. The only way we can win is if we stick together. You're no different than us. 
You cry, you laugh, you hope, you worry. We're your friends and your comrades, and you're an important part of us. Bear with us your burden, and we'll topple every obstacle. Let me to open up to you, but I'm scared. You'll all die, and I'll continue living. I'll be all alone again. I know what you mean. All too well. I was married, and I had kids in my previous life. It hurts to think about how they're all dead now. Would I rather have met my... Would I, would I rather have... But would I rather have never met my wife and had no children? That emptiness would hurt so much more. Look deep inside of you. Is it all worth it? Wasn't it all worth it? Thank you, Lynn. Exactly what I needed to hear. You're right. Nothing is more scary than an empty heart. Received new quests. Also. We got more of these. More points. Right. We're good on skills right now. Guy armor. Well, what do we got quest wise. Those little icons next to each entry are, but uh, get out of here.
All right. Now we go to... Probably the finale. Madeline, what happened here? Oh, terrible. Let me see to our wounds. You really succeeded in opening the gate. Ah. What happened? A group of pandits appeared. Apparently they followed us when we arrived here together. After I, after I opened the gate, they overpowered me and headed deeper into Nyssa. Bandits, huh? Somehow I have a bad feeling. I'm fine now. You should still rest par properly. Oh dear, what a terrible situation. The gate to Nyssa stands open and I have no strength to explore the mysteries that lie ahead. You'll have your chance. We on the other hand must hurry. Lynn is right. We need to go. And don't break anything and don't scare Azazel. Make sure you leave everything untouched. We'll make sure to leave everything untouched for you. See you later, Madeline. The one. And look at something here real quick. Friends. Okay. Oh, I wonder what the others are discovering around every corner in there. Huh? Who's there? What's the church doing here? Ah, oh, good. This is the legendary University of Nisa that my master used to tell me about. Yep, but it has changed a lot. Let me guess, a little less humanity? Huh? Oh dear, another me memory flash? No. It's different. Ah. What did you do? I don't know. Those g g g g ghosts Oh my. Maybe we should hurry. This cave is spacious, so we can easily call our sky members here. Come on, let's go! Look at this wonderful fountain. It was finished the other day. Only originally, only the students lived here. Since they came from wealthy backgrounds, they had a lot of money to spend. So it happened more and more that more and more ordinary people moved here and offered their services. 
These people in turn also had needs, and well, that's how the city grew. Okay. There we go. On the third head. <laughs> that's, I don't know if that's crass or just funny. Both. Or Calcum. La, 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 la. You seem happy today. Is it because we're the, the, near the end of our mission? But yes, that's exactly what the reason. Okay. Yeah. Going on the crest. Oh, there's another ghost. Uh. Jeez. So. Lucienna is afraid of ghosts. Lore, we need a key to proceed. That's a bronze marking. Oh my gosh, this is gigantic. <laughs> bronze keys and silver keys. I'm looking for treasure chests at this point. I can't do anything but hover on the ground, but that's okay. Sometimes I wonder if they arrived at the Academy of Alandas. There was nothing here, and the students had to travel from far away. Come on. Nobles from every country in Nyssa. That must be why they chose the neutral location such as the Landis. I think Nissan was built here in the middle of nowhere so that students could concentrate on their space. Welcome! You can find the freshest goods of all, in all of Atlantis.
get rid of all these lesser weapons as well. New deals. More new deals unlocked? Okay, cool. What? Let's see if I can, uh... We need to proceed. Yeah. The third head. Play five hundred. Ooh. So, so rich, they even built an artificial lake. They purchased private. The private airships can be parked here. Need a key to proceed. Silver marking. Yeah. 
yet another level of... Oh, hi. There we go. Hey. Park an airship, you should do so in the water. This is best for the whole. just yet. Got a number of places I need to go. You know what? Let's go up this way. Brugia. These dorks again. I don't mean to boost, but all of us finding this treasure is all because of me. Yeah, following well, Sienna here was a great idea. But who would have thought this plain warehouse would be so full of treasure? Feels like some money bags trying to ship their wealth from here in a hurry. Whatever the reason, now we can start a new life. You believe this gold could cleanse your hands of blood? Yeah, see ya. Say I'm pleased to see you alive. We can change that. You've come a long way to die. My dear, since the last time, we've gotten a lot stronger. I don't even, I don't think you stand a chance anymore. Actually, I'd love to get back to you for what you did to Madeline, but there's no time for it. Take this treasure for all I care and start a new life. If it means having four bandits less in this world, I'm fine with it. You want to talk? The greatest thief in all of Eldrea. I'm definitely not someone you should look up to. <laughs> don't you dare think we're... Don't you dare think we're so green so as to fall for your trap. We'll strike us in the back. You want our treasure. Your treasure. I don't think talking will take us any further. Now you speak the truth. Alright. We get to have a fight against the, uh... <laughs> the 
comic relief. Ah. Yeah. Wind thrust, wind thrust. Got him. <laughs> Stupid. Why are so many throwing why are so many throwing in, willing to throw away their lives so easily? I I This outcome was inevitable. Do you know what's the first thing that dies inside you when you choose the path they did? your trust. First it's the trust in others. Then it's the trust in yourself. You walk this path for too long, you only you begin to hear only lies. Everyone becomes your enemy. For them the only pure thing, the only truth was money. Thing here. A key made of copper. Back to the task at hand. Let's see what this key can open. Hmm. All right. Silver key. That's a lot of money to be made in this. I think we'd open a bakery here. Hmm. 
I'll come back to that. It's dragons. Or rivers. Poison Salvo. Drone Swarm. Hmm. Wild, wild, uh. Wild something. Excuse me. Oh. Hmm. All right, we're going to go to the west real quick. Because... You got lots of things to pick up. Great sword. Hey, Galarian, how's it going? I'm in the final dungeon. I'm in the final, final, final dungeon. Well, not the final, final, final dungeon. The final main dungeon. All day long, I see one carriage after another leaving the city. Coming from the academy. I wonder what's going on there. Yeah, it's getting close.
There we go. My gear down. Uh, it's doing all right. I have, you know, still plugging away at this. So, uh, I did want to beat it before I, you know, I didn't want to beat it tonight. I wanted to beat it tonight. So, uh, especially because I wanted to, an extra night for, um, extra night for, uh, Crystal Project in case I needed it. Um, I might have some extra content, though. So I might come back to this. I don't know about immediately, but, um... This is gonna be one that I do some post-game, new game plus stuff in. At some point. Silver key. Because there is apparently quite a bit of it. Okay. I just don't know how much yet. We needed to go to the market. Also, go up this way. No, nope, no, nope, nothing up this way. You know what? We could probably... Yeah, we've got some stuff. Let's learn some skills. Learn all passive skills except for... Let me kick. Oh, actually. And... Hmm. <laughs> Well, targets resistance, building berserker, meditation song. Let's hit specialist. Plus HP regen. Summon effects? Nice. Guy. Invert? Lucky seven. Alright, as far as Sky Armor goes, let's see, I've got Kerberos and I've got Merlin. I might switch to a Kerberos model. There we go. Glaive 500. And Shield 500. Great sword 500. Cool. Anything else? Bowgun 500. Um, offensive drones 5? No, support drones 500. Yeah, we're gonna use support drones. Alright. Oh stuff. Hmm. 
Hmm. There's so much more that I can do here. And... I get... Now if I get this piece right here, if I beat one more earthworm, then I'll be able to connect another chain. If I find... Well, no, I gotta go to the archipelago. This... and the hidden cave... Okay, there's three hidden caves here, at least. Okay, but I gotta find another earthworm. Nonetheless. Oh my gosh. Well, let's turn around here. We're going this way. A second. I get the thing? Yeah, I got the thing there. I just got the pun here. The color scheme. The color scheme name is goddamn, but that's a pun. Because it matches the Gundam. The, the original Gundam scheme. <laughs> That's pretty good. Okay. Good. Oh, we got to reverse that. Six out of six earthworms. <laughs> I got two tiny third heads. Good. Okay, also, there's my chain. There's my other, my other thing I needed. Sacred water. Okay. Hey, man. What else for you? Oh, there we go.
There we are. Actually, I need to go back here because I've got to go back to this forge by the fountain. Move from armor. Yeah, you know, I'm not even gonna waste any resources on upgrading my web my um It's this. I'm gonna upgrade this. No, I'm gonna upgrade my armor. Where I can, at least. Some crystals here. Bum, bum, bum. Bum, bum, bum. Master Claw Master Claw Master. So that claw master's cashed out. Fire resistance. Cashed. EP up is cashed. Pistol Master's cached. Anything else? Anything else? Nope. Up here. Um. Big Extender still has two charges on it. Wet Strike has five has three charges on it. Good attack is cached. I don't know. Um gosh. Um probably more sausage and eggs, uh, for me at least. Um I usually don't really change up my routine. Uh not that I can afford to, but uh like I used to. But that's okay. That's okay. Also got some toast and uh maybe a uh, a grain a fruit and grain bar. I don't know. It depends on, uh... Gosh. It's been a while since I've, since I've eaten an, a, a breakfast on my own terms in a lot of ways, but, uh... At least, it's been a while since I've eaten a, a breakfast that I've kind of gone, you know, above and beyond, at least. And even when I did that, 
It usually turned into brunch. <laughs> Bacon and rice. Rice for breakfast? I mean that I'm not gonna question it. I already did question it. Um, but yeah. That's just something I've never heard of I've never thought of before. But, then again, I've eaten breakfast for dinner before, so. Not wrong with that. So we got anything else new on this uh, front? Ooh, I'll strike first. I'd rather. I don't know. I'd rather grow strike first and miss something more there. Same thing with this Ultra 2. Well, no, I can't really do that. Okay. I kind of overshot my, uh... It's go 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 ghosts. We got him.
need to proceed. There's a silver door cable. Raffle. There we go. All right, now. See here. Now well, what works? Deals. Another thing of plot armor, huh? Okay. Huh. think oh, no not there
And a silver bolero. Hmm. Lots of little passageways here. See here. Gonna need her. Well, no, it's not an ultimate sword yet. All right, where else? Um, ooh. Or going into the wine cellar. There's a... Hmm. Yeah. Call these corridors wine cellars because that's their primary use at the moment. Originally, they should they had another purpose. As far as replayable games, this, in general, it's usually just things that, um, games that, um, I'm just trying to think of, of game. I'm, I'm trying to sort of think about games that I've replayed. Honestly, it's really about good memories and wanting to sort of reconnect to those memories of, 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 you know, playing a game. And even though it's never going to be as good as the first time that you play it, it's, you know, there's an appeal there that, uh, be at least kind of like, yeah, I want to see what this is all about. I want to see what, what this is all about all over again. Uh, uncanny encounter? I don't think that's, that's enough. I did enough damage. Oh! Got it. But also sort of a feeling that, you know, I kind of feel like I have unfinished business with the game, or I want to sort of reevaluate what I thought about the game originally. Uh, usually with the game that I kind of bounced off of because I didn't understand certain aspects of it. Or, you know. Or a game that I wanted to sort of give a, give a better chance to because I just didn't have the time. Is this the same place? Yeah, it's the same place. But there's a lot of different reasons why. I mean... Expensive, do expensive doorknob? Okay. Oh, 
Or maybe it's a feeling of like, you know, you get the sense that you can understand certain aspects of a game more intimately since playing, you know, other games that are like it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, that's another thing. It's like, it's like you want to try new strategies or you want to, uh, you know, you feel like you can connect to something in a game that you weren't able to connect to before. Um, I mean, I did that with, um, I did that with a lot of the earliest, like, computer RPGs that I played, um, from, like, the, the early 90s. Um, I mean, that's sort of what, you know, revisiting Minds of Titan was about last summer. Um, that was really cool, even though it didn't necessarily, um, didn't necessarily live up to everything that I thought it was going to be, but it was still, it was still good. Let's go. Scholar's Habit. Okay, no, I don't want to go that way. I want to go this way. Crocus. Air jump. Nice. Air strike. Next turn. I don't know why, but it feels like something should be here. Oh, it is. Okay. can go to the market. There we go. Yeah. Um. Oh. 
Sifixia raided the stream with 12 viewers. Sifixia, how are you doing? Hi, ah, hello, raiders. <laughs> Thank you so much. Uh, how was, uh, hopefully you, uh, let's see here. Oh. How was, uh, Evil Within? Yeah, we're getting in. We're closing in. We are closing in. Thank you so much for reading your books here. Uh, yeah, t you finished Evil Within? Nice. I, uh, that's one, I'm not really much for horror games, but that's one that's always interested me. Just because of the presentation. But, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm Rat Clown Car, folks. Uh, I do retro and indie games, and, uh, mostly RPGs. But I do all sorts of stuff, really. Um, it was better than you anticipated? Nice, very cool. But, uh, yeah, currently I'm working on Chain Echoes. Um, I'm getting cl close to the end. Uh, I'll be returning to Crystal Project next. Uh, which is probably me next stream. Um, and... I've also got, uh, ZOZ, which is a, uh, a ZZT, um, game that was made in 2022. And, uh, I'm working on a few other, I'm working on a bunch of 2022 games this month. Uh, next month I'll be working on Fantasy Star, the, uh, the entirety of the Mega, of the, uh, Master System and Genesis and Mega Drive games. Uh, as well as the Game Gear titles, Fantasy Star. So, uh, yeah. That's gonna be a lot of fun, because that's a, a game, uh, that's a game series I've always really enjoyed, but never had a chance to really finish up. Um, I haven't played 4, and I haven't played the Game Gear titles or the, um, Adventure series that, uh, came out around the time of 2 in Japan. But, uh, yeah. Hopefully your stream went well, and, um, yeah. What else have you been up to lately as far as, uh, as far as, uh, games, uh, Suffixia? Anything else? Ooh. Yeah, I'm trying to look for hidden treasures somewhere. This is now one of the largest cities in Altria. Well, it was. There we go. Nice buried treasure. Also, what's next on what's next uh in your in your game plans? So well, always always want to hear what's uh what people have coming up. And here, and a rapier. Let's see here. Is playing Bucky O'Hare next? Nice. The, uh, that's, that's the, uh, the NES game, the Famicom game, right? I need to dig more into... I need to dig more into a lot of, uh, NES stuff that I hadn't touched yet. Uh, I've played so much of it that it just kind of becomes routine. But there's a lot that I haven't touched. On day three, Yakuza Kiwami, yeah. Oh, oh yeah, I know what about. That's awesome. You do a you do a VTuber stream. Oh, that's so cool. And you've been playing uh, Unavowed. My um, one of my mods, TorbSP, who raided me earlier on, uh, is currently working on the Blackwell games. And 
yeah, he's been a really big fan of the Black Bowl games uh, lately. And he's three games in, and he's wor and he's got two more to do. So, uh, yeah. Yeah, the Watch and I stuff is really cool, though. <laughs> when you're tired, night at your time, it's a VTuber character on. Nice, nice. Um, yeah, I'm, I really like uh, the Yakuza series as well. I've been thinking about doing, um, Like a Dragon, um, maybe said to be the sixth step. Yeah, I've heard that. I've heard that. Um, I've been thinking about doing the uh, Like a Dragon, uh, Ishin that's coming out here soon. They're doing a, uh, it's a remake of the, uh, of the, uh, first of the, the uh, like the samurai spinoffs that they did that were Japanese only back in the day. The Numenera. Oh, nice. Um, yeah, I was just talking about Numenera earlier. Um, especially the tabletop, uh, the tabletop stuff with, um, with, uh, with, uh, the cipher system. Uh, and how much I really like the uh, the cipher system as a as a tabletop as a tabletop uh, system, uh, even over like D and D uh, and 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 three point five and and you know a lot of other stuff nowadays. Uh, and how much and I want to get back into playing uh, cipher system games as well, but who knows if I'll ever have time for that. But yeah, 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 Bucky O'Hare next. Like I said, I need to do a, a deep exploration of like oddball Famicom games that I or oddball Famicom and NES games that I'd never really touched. Uh because yeah, I played a lot of them in the past, but there's so many that I just haven't messed with. There we go. What? And what was the other one that she said? Oh, Wildfire. Yeah. Wildfire is similar to, um... It's kind of similar to, uh, um... What's that game? Yeah. Oh no, I, yeah, it's... So much of the mechanics, though, uh, feel like, um... Uh, kind of resemble Noita. With how... With how things can kind of, kind of go out of control if you let them. But, uh, yeah, that's awesome. Thank you. Well, again, thank you for bringing folks here. And, uh, thank you again for the raid. And, uh, yeah. Yeah. I said just about to wrap this one up. Where did we go? Here we are. Hmm, is it down here? Yeah. There we are. Oh no, where are we? 
No sky armor. Oh well. Sometimes the trees start to burn for no apparent reason. Something is wrong here with the ether that flows here in Nisa. Somehow it ignites with the smallest spark. I think it's the perfect subject for our doctoral thesis. Oh, hi. You swing. Nice, nice. Fire jump. Got it. Rising dragon. Go for it. That's right. Oh, staggered. We're fine, we're fine. There we go. I've got to save that one. For, um... Oh, come on. one okay. um let me figure out how to cure stagger Can't cure stagger. Only blind and 
Defend. Defend. I'm doing this for a reason. Defend. There we go. Uncanny encounter. Ah, there we go. <laughs> How are you doing, Michael? Thanks for stopping in. Yeah, Tom K has a, uh, the mechanic centered around Turning the turning the enemy just, the enemies into beverages, but he can only do it when they're like uh, thirty percent health or less. Okay, how do I get to this treasure chest? Oh, I gotta get in the water. Ugh. Blah. Yeah. Yeah, I, I I think I like Tom King most too, but uh I don't know, there's some There's some really messy written characters here uh, in the game. But uh it's okay. It it, it kind of hold it holds itself together overall. Is there anything I can do with the purple figure? No. I know one thing. Start with an opener. Drop some flames. We swing. Um. Uh, oh, no. Falling dragon. There we go. Rising Dragon. Uh, who we got? Who we got? Uh, I didn't use Steel. Oh well. Just in time. Defend. Defend. There we go. Uh oh. Defend. That's fine. That stagger, I'd better take him out then. Oh no! Oh well. I guess I guess death stagger means that they can't move and let uh they have to uh rainbow they're not able to move uh under penalty of death I'm guessing that's it I've never run across death stagger before so so what hmm there we go. Oh, Crystal. You see bubbles? I think we can take a dive there. Good. 
look around. There's bubbles. You can barely see them, too. Some more bubbles. Are there any down here? I don't see any. Maybe. Maybe. Where is this? No? Any bubbles around here? Nope. This way. I've never found a cave in the water, but then that's kind of my fault. It's a lot of money. It's this way. Yuck. down here? No. Alright. Let's get all these out. That was wind jump. Whatever. <laughs> Whatever. We killed them all. <laughs> and another grave finished. It's stuck with the donations. It's a mess. People are not aware that either donations they're doing at the academy are not quite so harmless. Every hundred the person dies. But well, for money, people become deaf and blind. It's gruesome. Kind of creepy. What? You dare, you really dare to oppose us humans. I think their knees are shaking now that we're approaching. Almost you do not have reason. Haven't you realized it yet? Remember, what is the goal of the church? Ever since Martyrs took control, 
They've been trying to free the Harbinger. They wish to summon death upon Andrea, and yet at the same time, they provide prosperity to the whole world. We, on the other hand, have imprisoned the Harbinger and do not want him to return. Yet we destroyed the human race again and again. How can you make sense of all this? I don't understand what you're getting at. Of course not, because everyone is fooling you, child. Have you never wondered where the Harbinger is sealed? What his prison is? With our magic eons ago, we did not lock him in a physical prison. Prison, where the Harbinger has been waiting for his return, is the Maelstrom. The Aether of the Dead are the bars of his cage. What does that mean? E? Remember the shells of Magnolias. The amount of Aether in the Maelstrom is limited. There are more people that are, that are alive at the same time. The weaker the prison, uh, the, the prison the Harbinger becomes. That's why the church makes sure that life is created. That's why we keep... That's why we make sure that enough ether keeps flowing back. That's what the monsters in the church's laboratories are for? That's why that lump of flesh has to have so much energy stored in it? They're draining the maelstrom. Free the Harbinger. Do you understand now? We have been your allies all this time. Turn back. Let us continue our work. Then call back your orb of fire. No, Lin. Lin? One way or another, we have to stop the vein. It can't be right for them to destroy humanity over and over again. What other choice is there? How many centuries have passed without a weapon being found against the Harbinger? More without us, more and more humans will be born. The maelstrom will run dry, and his cage will break. Ah, uh, while well, you are still as helpless as in the beginning. But why is that? It's because you've systematically been throwing humanity back into the dark for millennia. All technological progress dies. How will we ever find a weapon like that? The risk is too great. No, we're not going to let that happen. If it costs that many lives... We would rather take the risk. I'm convinced that humanity will find a weapon given the chance. Lin, you're right. If we don't try, we'll never know if we could develop a weapon. Our goal is our goal is clear. The the veins eternal cycle of destruction must find an end. Children. We understand. Reasoning with your kindest folly, it always has been. Eats. We're getting close. We're getting close. What's up this way? Eh. Very good. All right. Oh, also, I haven't even done this. Okay. Yeah, well, we're almost finished with this game. How are you doing, commonly rare? Give Commonly Rare a follow, by the way. They're working on uh, GameCube Gauntlet, where they 100% uh, GameCube games. 
and uh, also playing a bit of uh, Final Fantasy XI on the Horizon server on the side. Which they kind of took me into playing offline. <laughs> or playing, uh, playing off stream, rather. Once we're done here, we'll return home. What do you do for a living? Martial arts training. I would have thought it would. I would have thought it would be something to do with food. That's just what my parents do. When you're in the middle of puberty, you're doing the opposite. You, you're doing the opposite. Oh, that makes sense. And of course, rare. Where are we going? No. One. One. Instead of going this way, it's a fun game. I mean, if you like, if if you like the uh, the mid to late nineties uh, RareSoft JRPGs, especially this the later Super NES ones, and um, I mean, you know, it even takes cues from from Final Fantasy VII in some ways with the uh, with a system that's kind of like Materia, but um. Yeah, I mean, it's fun. Even with all my... Even with all my, my weird hang-ups about some of the writing and some of the uh, character overshare, I really like this game. Oh, okay, so we're looking for a... Before we continue, I want to go back to... This area. I didn't take this route here. Oh, okay. No, no, no. Of course I didn't. That's a zone change. Okay. Yeah, I will be getting back to Crystal Project tomorrow, I think. Um, in a minute, I'm going to take a short break while I uh, grab some breakfast. But uh, I will be back play to finish this off this morning. I don't want to necessarily leave this hanging. Uh, like, you know, an hour to go or whatever. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Back in the back in the max. Back in the, the sky armor.
There we are. Here's FP500. Did I not pick up picking him on five hundred? Oh Well that's okay, that's silver key stuff. I'll pick that up on the Silver Key trips. A few more days and we're done. The Ether donation, we have enough energy to execute the plan. Huge. That's the true King Asnadel. Be quiet or you'll wake him up. Giant dragon. Looks friendly. Right? It's a gold marking, huh? Okay. Let me make sure I won't run into like repeat mobs. Okay, good. Good. Right. I'm going to be right back in a moment. Uh, actually, I'm going to give this another 30 minutes. Just in case. Find this find out where we left off here on this thing. Ah. Uh. Okay. That's that. I need to go up this way. And down again. Oh, okay. We can do this. I 
Nice. Wow. That's what I needed. I want to make sure I had the best armor, or the best sky armor here. Um, for the next fight that I have to take on. Uh, so the next few are gonna be tough. Extremely tough. Let me see, what else? I mean, I could go... Update this because because we're sticking with this until the end. I might take a break here in a few seconds, a few minutes. We're sticking with this until the very end. See this through. Let's get on the ground. Knightly sword. What else is this way? Okay, okay, I see now. So what I'm going to do... There's no passageways here. That's okay. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna come back to this town, this bottom, uh, where the where the water fountain is, because this is where I need to do a lot of upgrading and stuff. I need to get my weapons all right. You know what? Actually, no. We're gonna just, we're just gonna upgrade swords.
There we are. Group armor. Uh, I need some more calcum. Auto combine. Okay. I will be back in just a moment. But for now, enjoy some reels while I get food items. All the drugs. Can you do that all night? We can do more of them for sure. I have a lot a lot of them. A lot. Wait, why can't I read that message? Why is that message go away? Okay, well, whatever. Oh, no, you didn't. No, you didn't. I swear to God, I hate this place. Send around in a BBS demo or a cover disc or whatever. <laughs> Do not taunt happy fun airlock. <laughs> Dark Forces was February 28th, 1995, really before all the new tech changes. Okay. That was... That was fantastic. I completely forgot about that warning about the airlock. Oh, that's not good! <laughs> Ouch! Dump starts. All right, here's our goal. That's why everybody asking like what the goal is? It's right here. The mayor declares that the city is going to become a 10 million population city. We we started the game with a murder, a double murder. Let's drag the body over to this guy, bring him back to life, ask him who did it. Case solved. To his voice, just makes me want to slap him in his stupid face. <laughs> what, I didn't say nothing, I said nothing. Oh God. I'm a mobile. <laughs> Don't make me do it. <laughs> uh, but we keep watching the show. I know, I know, and I'm part of the problem, and I realize that. I realize that. Fucking a sub. All right, actually. Let's just keep going. I can breakfast can wait a little bit. Just a little. this way. Oh. Orchard.
the fact the funny thing is that I I um need let's remove oh, hold on a second. We're gonna do this. Great armor. Right, uh, that's right. We can't do anything with it because of no orc alchem. I can't buy any orc alchem either. It's just gonna be me resetting the instance to get the the uh, park back open, or to get the park back with uh, with mobs. Which just stinks. That's that's no way to do that. I may as well just not bother then. We'll remove this from Well, I will remove stuff from any weapon I'm not using. Let's see what else we got. Nothing, nothing. Ether killer. Let's go ahead and merge that fire attack then. Hmm. Hmm. Violence resistance. Love HP Drain 9, that's my favorite sequel. Right first. Now, let's start setting stuff into weapons. Uh, sword Master? Yeah. Dark attack. Rainbow. Oh, master. Foot. 
Yeah, it's about to the end of this one, by the way. Uh, Katana Master? I'm in the final... I'm in the final dungeon. Hmm... Uh, light attack? Light attack. Light attack's fine. We're gonna bring... We're gonna bring Sienna back into the main party. Great sword. Um, great sword master? Yeah. What? <laughs> Dark attack. Okay. New formation. Uh, Mika. Almost wanna Do I wanna hmm oh. Yeah, let's go for it. All right. I was gonna break for breakfast, but breakfast is nowhere near ready, so, uh... Oh, we're still... ...doing this. Hello, dragon. Months I've been doing nothing but drawing these symbols. What do they mean? No clue. I just draw them as the professor ordered. Yes. Really, you don't mean Professor Bartholomew? Ovelia. Let me see what this uh, Ovelia scar armor is, by the way. Not good. It's just not good. Okay, cool. So we got a connecting door to the front part of the uh front part of the wine cellar. Hello, little mouse. Boy. Alright. 
Well, this is one where I think... Hmm. We're gonna put... Micah in front on this one. Uh, opener. Nice. Twice. Alright, we're in full bloom. Echo, good. Oh, that's good. One of those red-eyed beasts, wasn't it? Yes, they feel different from the rest of the monsters we fight. They feel their hatred towards me. Who's there? Good job. You have almost reached your destination. Just walk out of the wall? Alien, what are you doing here? I'm looking after you. I don't want you to fall back because of these me just because of these meager fiends of the Harbinger attack you. The red eyed beast belong to the Harbinger. The wicked evil at the heart of the Maelstrom stands not idle. Cross the ether around him, giving a birth to a special kind of monster. Am I the target of the Harbinger and his monsters? Well, his actual target is Master Gwine. Master has a certain aura about him that the Harbinger follows. And ever since Master Gwine designated you as his successor, that aura has been attached to you. What are you talking about? Don't worry too much. You failed as a successor. I 
taken over that role now. You better concentrate on the target ahead, the vein. Wait. Killian, what does all this mean? Knowing Gwen, he'd rather tell it himself. Let's go. Oh, so I got skills. Burn. Tank. Don't I have the other enmity skill, enmity passive skill, or whatever? I guess I don't. Um. No, 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 no. Was one oh guess look out for it we created it yet we forgot what it looks like and what it was capable of just remember I wish I could remember what color it had. Do you remember?
Yes, that's it. Feed these pig ears then. Opener. Fire jump. Nice. Falling dragon. Excellent. I can go upstairs. Let me do that though. Lots of things to find. What was my first impression of it? If only I could remember. Yes, that's it, that's it. armor. I mean... Even in my mind, but I don't remember. What was the specialty? I've read about this creature creating a phoenix before. We called the phoenix before creating it. You know, the one that can resurrect itself, or was it after? I've read about the phoenix much later. Please, so that's it. Thank you. Someone would furnish on the second floor. Uh oh. Hello, Blabo. There we go. Enemy adapts to the memories around it. Thrust. Water strike. 
Hey. How's it going? Like a bunch. We are almost there. We are almost there. Alright, I sort of reduced some of that overdrive. Or, yeah, over. Okay. And rod thrust. Water strike. How many bosses do I have left? I have a couple more. Most of this is pretty, uh, pretty serious, though. We're coming in on the, uh, the finale. Burn. resistance sure okay oh, we've got a little bit more left to go yeah we uh we took care of it South again. Yeah, I didn't get any more talcum, so I may as well just go in. Just go for it. You attack the church. You killed the Pope. If nothing for you but hatred. Jesus, dude. Wait. I demand vengeance, godless woman. I can't hope to defeat us in sky armors. Huh. Only the devil with the, is without hope. I can rest. I cannot rest as long as your blood still runs warm. So die. Jeez, that's... And Halbert. <laughs> what? You absolute wild man. Wind, wind shot. Weakness. Arc. I 
Nice. Ah, up in some break. Support orb. Orb provides Wyatt with a different set of abilities. We need to destroy it. Yeah, yeah. I'm on it. He's dead now. Please don't orb. Here we go. There we go. Thrice? up with Raz. Mm. Victor. Victor. Summoning support orb. Heal. We have to heal all like real soon. We're good, we're good. over, Wyatt. Silence. What are you doing? He's taken Numa, a drug that increases physical and magical capabilities. You've got to be kidding me. The Inquisition has passed judgment. Feel the vengeance of God, you heretics. <sighs> what? Eva? I couldn't listen to this any longer. Traitor. Eva! Is this it? Eva! 
Is this the destiny that God has chosen for me? Wow. Let me take a look. Just a few broken bones. What are you doing here? We followed your life, Anka. But I did not come for the same reason as him. I wanted to apologize. I realized what I said was wrong. I blamed you for the fact that you should have stayed back then. That you had changed the church from with the that you should have changed the church from inside with us. I know. But I was a coward and fled. No, I can't blame you for that. When you exposed the problems against the church, we all took a defensive attitude. We didn't want to admit it. How could I expect you to say when I was pushing you away from me? We didn't give you a chance. Eva. Running out. I don't know what you're trying to do here, but go ahead. My body hurts, but I will survive. I've healed the worst wounds. She should be fine for the time being. We'll, we'll pick you up on the way back. Promise. I know, Sienna. But go now. Wow, 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 wow. Learn some more skills. Um, counter crit up. Mind up. Magic up. Mind up. Ability up. Points up. Life killer. Back up. Let's resistance. HP up. Auto aura. All right. Here we go. Off the cliff. Hmm. Here we are. The magic circle under Nisa. Magic... There's a mag... There's a magic circle under Nisa. Every time magic's cast, make sure the small amount of ether is collected. Been doing this for decades. Gordos and Nisa serve as a magic circle? Maybe that's why the, that's why there are magic symbols all over the place. Oh my. There's like two doors here I could go in. We need vast amounts of ether. We built this place as an academy that magically gifted people from every country can come here. You're kidding. Nisa was only built was built only so we could construct the gate in secret? At the location of a small flying island. Should be located should currently be located west of Alandis. Flying Island. Elevator key. Elevator key. Elevator key. We got an elevator coming up. Our gate, once the gateway to the vein is built, they will sense the connection. They'll come looking for us. Nisa must disappear from the scene. Literally. Thinking the whole academy? Are you insane? Once thousands of kingdoms ruled all of Eldrea, 
But after the Great War at the end of the Fifth Gate, only a few powers remained. Whether this was good or bad for peace on Eldrea remains to be seen, but what's certain is the entire world had to undergo a structural and, above all, cultural change. When the kingdoms and lands united, the weak cultures were displaced and homogenization took place. Eldrea lost much of its former splendor. Lady Raina will keep the key for the order. I wonder... I wonder how long it will take to find a weapon. Goldarum, the Hermit. is that we can't warp around I am not struggling at all though with weapons I don't necessarily want to fight my way back through this again although honestly Well, let's see here. Honestly, I think I can probably do this. And it's just... Yeah, that's right. We headed out. Because we're going to that island over there. All those... <laughs> See, see, that's, that's game, that's something that should have been addressed in the game design. The, the map should wrap around the world. I don't care if it doesn't make any sense. It should happen. These weapons, these legendary armors, are you veiled, the legendary blacksmith? You are. The quality of this equipment is answer enough for me. I sense a certain affinity between you and blacksmithing. You forged your own prosthesis? I did. There is life in them as well. Hmm? What's this I'm sensing? That rusty sword there. Give it to me. Oh, that old rusty thing I gave you? That drifted in the fort of port of forest fort. Once again, the, this rusty patina hides a weapon I once forged. So again, it returns to me. Can you resort? My weapons are of the highest quality. That is a firm truth, but they also carry a curse. They want to return to me by any means necessary. You see those weapons out there? I forged them for some of the strongest and bravest knights. But at some point, they all died, and the weapons came back to me in some way. So you don't want to help us? No, that's not what I mean. I'm a blacksmith. And my life's work is to forge exceptional weapons, unrivaled in all of Eldrea. I do not refuse any order since it is my duty and the life I choose. Anyone who wields a weapon must be ready to die anyway. But I do this work with a guilty conscience. That's why I live here on this island. Rarely do people join me here to place an order. We have held great help. We'll take any risk. In the end... Some of us are quite familiar with curses. Give me the weapon. Dang. Unbelievable. It looks brand new. Looks new, true. That's as far as usefulness goes. The weapon is completely blunt. You can't fight with it. The real strength comes only when you upgrade it. And that has its price. I'm a blacksmith and have to make ends meet somehow. So listen well. Bring me a rusty weapon and a solo farnese, and I'll restore it to its former glory. 
Solar Farnese. Where do you find that? Very valuable and very rare. But you should find some scattered across Volandus. So keep your eyes open. Well, thank you. Alright, so... All right, next up. Okay. Now, the doll. Um, Pappenheimer. Ooh. Okay, so I need the... Let me find out where these rusty weapons are real quick. Just so I can... Oh... Okay, well, I'm going to have to go and solve these puzzles anyway, I guess. But let's do that. We're going we're gonna to stay right here. And I'll be back in just a moment. I'm going to get some breakfast real quick. right back shortly.
right. All right. Let's do this. Oh, we're gonna call an audible about the direction of where of things now, because uh, we are going to backtrack a couple of for a couple of things, so I can get <clears throat> some ultimate weapons. Ultimate weapons. Really, really cool weapons. Uh, I need to find... Number one, I need to find the Rusty Spear. This is the way to the Rusty Spear. How this involved solving puzzles? Puzzles. Hmm. Hmm. No, I'm the right one. West. North, east, and south. And east. There we go. East. Then north. More west, back east. Good. Push this up and there. Grichi. Hmm.
Got him. The gambler. Okay, get out of here. All right, the one work we're going to go to next is going to be over here. This is the one. This is the one. We got three orbs. Good. Now we can push this up. It's over. No. We're going the right north. Is this over? We gotta loop this back around again. The plate. Good. Rune Knight's important. Oh, hollow. Rusty spear. Don't possess any sacred water. Well, I'll have to come back for that. Real easy way to get my next, uh, oh, my next Grimward shard at least. Never mind. Let's see if I can't get... Let's see if I can't get the next, uh... Let's see item. 
Ooh, okay. Hmm. Great sword. It's a reward board thing. Anna. Okay. Okay, well we're gonna go see We're gonna go to the we're gonna go to the, the mountain range. Fly around some. Where are we? Where are we? Up here? Sure. We have camps all over Katara in case we need to flee. What is the rock bottom another here and I'm sorry, I'm not supposed to tell you this stuff. Well, you told me. Thanks for the info. So Norgan, how did you trade with us? Well, you are the critics of wings, after all. You aren't able to get stuff the legal way very easily, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You keep it under your hat. Did you get the 50 Palace and Ark? Here it is. Pleased to be doing business with you guys. <laughs> a Norga on my hand. I demand retribution. Shut up. Buy yourself a prosthetic or something. Come back anytime. I'm sure I'll have more stuff that you're interested in. Rude. What a rude dude. Armor looks similar to Gwines. Maybe when I get close. Feels as if he left it for me here. Really thought of the padlock. Their farmer should be able to undo these chains. I'll free it and then we can return. Cool. Excellent. Oh, hey, paved birds and everything. Oh, wait. Oh, that was part of the whole thing before. Okay. Let's go back. Really? Yeah, let's go back. I didn't mean to do that. Anyway. Going back here, we're gonna buy a katana. Rusty katana at that. Yeah. What do you mean, not enough money? Don't think I forgot what you did to us. Leave me alone, my hand still hurts. Don't <laughs> Yesterday, I stole candy from a baby. And you know what? I didn't even eat it. Love that. Love that for you. Anyway, let's go in here. Ah, oh, you need anything? Let's get rid of the...
Let's see what the sky armor thing is gonna be that I'm gonna put on. Balthazar. Balthazar's super good. I don't know what to do about the uh, Ayajir. In any case, don't have an elemental cannon in M four hundred yet. All right, well. Right, let's sell some more stuff. Uh... Pavelia's just stinks. Alright, cool. Now I can return to, uh... The mountain range. That's nice. Let's, let's go for it. Pick up a, uh, a rusty uh, katana and uh... you're all right. Let's go find this rusty greatsword. Is it Ramana's Tower? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're going to have to kind of march back up the... To this elevator. That's okay, it's no big deal. Also, there's a chest. There's a chest we didn't pick up. Oh, around here. That one. Like,
mais. Well, yeah, well, we're selling that. That was a big pickup. Okay. The first clue should have been this music, honestly. But this was connected to the, uh, to the grottos. There we go, there we go. We're going to one half. Been to this this floor yet? So it's another thing. There we go. Hmm. Uh, it's probably the, probably the mechs. <laughs> Or probably the, 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 I guess the sky armor is what they are in this. Like, but you pick the, those up like two thirds of the, like, in like two thirds through the game. Okay, hold on a second. This is a very convoluted maze. <laughs> See here. Hmm. 
Huh. <laughs> yeah, exactly. It's a... Uh... If I missed a turn or what? But at this point, I'm trying to get to... Passageway to a merchant. Also... There are, like, more advanced suits of armor down here than I thought. Suits of sky armor than I thought. Which is pretty awesome. Oh, these things. Um, poison. Auto knight. But what I'm doing right now is I decided to take a detour for a little bit of optional content. But I'm very close to the final bosses. I just wanted to get a couple of ultimate weapons. Just so happens, we've got some cool treasure chests to get. Merlin FM 600, okay. Yeah, we're getting some... We're getting some weapons and armor down here for suits that are pretty much uncharted territory right now. Because the final dungeon only goes up to 500 models. And we're getting 600 models down here. Which I am totally good with. Uh, four, five, six. As long as we don't run in any super bosses down here, Paris six hundred. Poison Salvo. Oh, uh, Wild Slash. some poison. Who has a symbol of the of the crest that looks like Erdrick? Get a bit. Um oh you mean the 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 enemy. Yeah yeah it does look it does resemble the uh the dragon crest the dragon quest shield. I didn't notice that until now. <laughs> so busy looking at my sky armor that it's just like Notice that that's cool. Not a really a surprise at this point because this is this game is so full of references. Like all sorts of RPGs of the uh, 80s and 90s. And like not like super obvious references, they just sneak them in. I think it's pretty cool. Yeah, great sword. Alright, how do I 
I guess I have to go to four. I have to go to... Yeah, I have to go to four and six. We're going back up again. And over to four. Then we're going to... Okay, good. Good, good, good. Then we're going to six. And there's seven and five. Okay, well, I guess uh, I, uh, um, I didn't have to make that trip anyway, but that's okay. Okay, that's okay. That's okay. Uh, gear down. Auto Knight. Um, gonna overload the Auto Knight. Wild Splash. the golden knight again. Poison salvo. Overload. There we go. Ah, jerk. There we go. We're fine, we're fine, we're fine. Like, I have to actually use items to heal up. Head down. Uh, yes! Ooh. Hey, where is this? Oh. This is the other side of that lost door. Okay, so there's a golden voucher, huh? I've been bell. All right, number one, we're gonna sell some stuff. Well, hold on, is there a forge around here? No. Yeah, let's sell some, uh, number one. Uh, let's get our sky armor all together. What do we got? What do we got? Aganim, uh, Aganimnon? That's an upgrade. Great sword, 600. Sword and Shield, 600. Merlin, 600, yes. Elemental Cannon, 600, yes. Uh, Offensive Drones, yes. Okay, we're... We're good, I think. I'm getting this, uh... Rest of this in-game stuff. Uh, 
Um... Very good, okay. Oh, no. That's a good deal for those berries. Also, also, I can take this boat. I am curious what this boat leads to because it didn't even unlock that door. What is this? Discovered a new fast travel location. I'm worried that I'm going to run into a super boss somewhere around here. Oh, no, just bats. Stop it in. Dragon combo, dragon combo. Ooh. It'll blossom. There we go. Uh, no, I'm good for mine. Thank you so much. Sorry, please don't do this. Please don't do this. Why won't... There we go. What do you mean, unable to? Yeah. Don't do that stuff. <laughs> Don't do that stuff. Five thousand accumulated damage. Are you a... I don't know why, um, I don't know why the, uh, like, graphic design bots think that people want their streams to look like everybody else's streams. Um, you know. <laughs>
Doesn't make any sense to me. Or people that create graphic design bots, rather. The actual bots. Um... Where? Where? Am I looking now? Dragon. Heavy swing. Final blossom. Great stuff. What is that? Is this like... Um... I'm a little worried about this. Random mage. Oh my gosh. You... So anyway, I don't know what kind of thing I've, I've fallen into now. Any more that I'm missing here? I did take a trip by boat. I did take a trip by boat in the grottos. That's just, uh... That's a place I really don't want to go right now. We've got everything. There's some stuff that I just don't want to breach right now. do get this rainbow war can I 
might do this. Oh, right. The, um... What the thing? Well, Barrage. Oh. Shuffle. All right. So. Where's the uh, last treasure chest in here? I mean, wait, I know where it is. Or do I? Do I? This way. Reporting in you. Let's go to this other floating island. I'm gonna I'm gonna be doing a 13 hour stream tonight. Is that even a thing? Rusty great sword. Alright, there we go. Let's remove some stuff.
Alright. Upgrade weapons. Oh, right. Money. Money is everything, isn't it? Well, I know where to go. I know where I'm going. We're going to Tormund. Wherever it is. There it is. Going to uh, number Let's let's do this. Hold on. Formation. You know, out front. Let me go all the way down there. Video game. Yeah, I know. It's, it's kind of ridiculous. It's like, I don't know what, I don't know what I want from that. Okay. Have one remove that. Okay. Select all. There we go. Okay, now we go back here. Might have to go back to uh, New Wernshire as well to get. <clears throat> The more high level material. Bye. Or Calcum, I'll get. Titan leather. Loss aside. I don't know if I'll need that devil's head. Just in case. Modal fiber. Yeah, hey, son of a... Yeah, I'm almost done with this game. So, uh... 
getting very close to the end. Well, thanks for stopping by. How was your stream? I saw you were on uh, doing... A second. Doing some... Um... What was it that you were playing? I'm sorry. Let me give you a shout out, actually. Yeah, Bioforge. That's right. I knew it was like mid '90s origin. Folks that are here and awake, y'all should follow Son of El. Good folks, good people. You played it years ago, but you had a hankering to revisit. Bioforge has always been one of these games that I've been interested in trying, but I never have. Yeah, of course. Let's see here. Bloodstones. We absolutely need bloodstones. Um, an Emperor's Hide. We need Emperor's Hide as well. An Ancient Carcass. We got plenty of Rainbow War. Well, now... Yeah, I'm busy, I'm like, trying to forge, at this point, uh, the best weapons in the game. Or trying to upgrade the best weapons in the game. At least the ones that I'm going to be using. Yeah, I, I think I might have picked it up at some point on... D.O.G. Ah, oh, money. It's always money, isn't it? What can I get rid of? I'll get rid of Ovelia. And I'll get rid of Paris. Once I'm going to get... Great. Uh, no. Let's see here. Right, have a good night, Sonic. Uh, get, get, get some rest. Thank you. I'm about to get some rest in just a minute myself. Uh, as soon as I take down, like, three more bosses, maybe? <laughs> Hopefully that's all. All right. Now. Now we're going to set some crystals into weapons. Okay. Swordmaster? Swordmaster 5. Now we're gonna go... And then we're gonna set... Uh, something into the spear. Spearmaster. And then Katana Master or or Crit Damage Up. Crit Damage Up because I hit crits like so much already just uh, naturally. Uh, agility raises my crit rate with my current setup, and then... Alright, great sword. The meter. What is the great sword master that's... Ah, oh, I don't have that, that one... that one bobble great sword master anymore. Blah! Let's see here. Do I have... I have Light Attack. I do have Light Attack. Um... Upgrade Bell. 
Just by one. Or maybe by two. Oh no, I can't. Dang. Dang it. Alright, well maybe I can sell some stuff. I'll sell a piece of diamond armor since I'm not going to be using that. And then upgrade Velt to uh, four. And then I'll set Dark Attack into Bell. Alright, there we go. Alright, now let's change our bleh, formation up. Uh, we're gonna put Egil there on the back line for Raphael. Kind of relief. Um. Okay, okay. Let's get out of here and go to George. We are almost ready to, to take down the last of this, uh... Oh... I see, okay. Oh, no, 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 no. Alright, never mind. Not gonna, not gonna go in here. Okay, where? There he is. There's a thing I need to do. There is... Where's this... Where's this... Um... Friggin... Ah... Uh. Oh! Okay! There you go, buddy. Work on this has been an hour, so it's on me, okay? Engineer. Okay, so we got... Guy armor. Okay, yeah, yeah. Dajir, uh, Dajir. Oh, that's perfect. Cool. Okay. Sell that curve rose. And now let's get out of here. Let's just, let's, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Actually, hold on a second. What am I doing? Uh, City of Nyssa. Oh, yeah, that's right. We do have this one... one thing to fight through. Wind. I should probably run away.
not let myself like get into a this fight with with dragons with wyverns especially when I could always use the uh sky armor the highly powered sky armor take them on anyway You gotta talk to me? Oh well, I guess not. Hmm. Well, well, well. Is this the end of our travels? Oh well, might as well be honest. <laughs> Why well, last time? I have no wife and wife and kids. I'm a bachelor. And thanks to you, I'm pretty rich now. I don't even need- I don't need to work ever again. But I felt bad for lying to you. So I decided to follow you until the end of the journey. Well then, let me ask you one last time. Do you need anything? Ask us one last time if we needed anything. Got my theory on. Here it is. We should probably save. Yes, one last time if we needed anything. Thank you. Thank you so much for asking. It means a lot. Now, well, Wayne is waiting just ahead. Uh, okay. The door to the realm of the vein. <laughs> I missed a bunch. Oh, no, no, no. You're fine. Yeah, well, this is the end. So. Oh, my gosh. Or getting near the end. And it is indeed. You've reached your destination. Wine. Alien. Yeah, I, well... I, um... Kind of. <laughs> this is where the reign of the vine ends. When this door opens, we can reach the vine. But in return, they too can reach us. With their divine power, they have the advantage and can kill you humans before you even blink. It's humans. Who are you, Gwine? Well, you're... Have you forgotten already, Master Bot? You were never an ordinary student. I've been... I've been so many things in my long life, but you're right. I wasn't there to learn, I was there to teach. 
And I was teaching you the role of my successor without you noticing, Glenn. Slowly but surely, I adopted your ether to mine. What do you mean by that? Our ether needs to have the same color, the same scent, for you to be able to receive my abilities. You've been slowly receiving them for quite some time now. This is why you can witness the standstill of time. This is why you can manifest the dead souls in the maelstrom in the form of these children. This is why you can make the white door appear for Magnolia. This is why you'll be able to resist the power of the vein for a few moments to use the grimoire. You are my successor, Gleb. What? Why don't you do it yourself if you're so powerful? For tens of thousands of years, I roamed the world long before the Harbinger even existed, long before humanity existed. I'm at the end of my lifespan. I can only use a fraction of the power within me. I'm no longer an obstacle to the vein. It's you. What are you talking about, Master? You said Glenn failed. You said I had potential. Glenn stands before me stronger than ever. You were just a replacement that happened to fit because you spent a lot of time with them. What are you trying to say? Look at you. You don't have nearly you don't have nearly what it takes to control my power like Lynn. But am I supposed to live the rest of my life without a body? In this form? Well, ah, uh, what? What is that? Glenn! Stop it! We now complete the transfer of my power. It won't take long. Use it to withstand the power of the vein and kill them with the grimoire. Then I, then I will be no more. Then I will be free. Free from this endless mission. Ah! Stop it! Stop. Use my power to stand against the vein and kill them with the Grand Grimoire. Afterwards, you shall search for a weapon to heal the Harbinger. This will be your task going onwards. Kill him! Kill him, you fool! What are you- Give it to me! Give me the power of the will! Kill him! Kill him? I, I can't control it anymore! I- I- This energy... Yes! I can feel it! I can absorb it! Stop him! I did it, Glenn. Did you see that? I have the ultimate power. Shatter the vein. I will purify the world. And you... He took the will by force. He wasn't prepared for it. He can't control it. What are we going to do? Our back. You must... You, you must kill him. Wayne is dead. Eat in the door. Give it to me. Sorry, Kill Killian. I don't quite get it yet, but somehow my gut tells me I have to stop you. Stop me? You? Nothing, Glenn. Do you know who you're dealing with? Do you even know who Gwine was? Eat his memories. Gwine is the being who m made mankind forget his existence. Now I am him, and the one who will lead the world into a bright future. Jeez, this guy. Well. Well. The human Labrodia divert. Oh, good. Impossible. 
Root King's wish to the same as the order. To kill the Vane. To kill the Harbinger. They are the guardians of all beings of Eldria. Huh. What is this pain? What are you, son of a... The will is not bending. It's trying to escape me. Seems to be our last chance. We'll put you out of your pain, Killian. Then try it, Clint. Oh, good. Fire. Okay, inact inact is super good though. In this case, um, oh my, Shields up. Connect. Got him. Ah, resisted. No, you're fine. You're good. You're good. Preparing Ultima Strike. Two rounds left. Shot. We got him. It's mine. I'm not giving it away. The world is going down the drain. Only I can save it. Really. What is this place? place where you can't depend on your mechanical means. Stop it, Killian. You have no control over the power. Oh. Whoa. Okay. A true power. Oh my gosh. Okay, okay. Still, no. <laughs> All right. Oh, 
of the revolution. Good, 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 good. Fire jump. Celestial light. Nice. There jump. A freed is down. Offensive crush. Nice. Knock it off, Killian. That's enough. the will. Tell me the key phrase, the key to this door. If we're going to tell you. Can't properly read your minds yet. When you thought all of the key phrase when you all thought of the key phrase at the same time, it was understandable. You know me in my current state. I'm powerful enough to defeat defeat the vein. Be witness to it. Oh boy, yeah. To find the Lord of the Underworld, the gate shall open. Hello, my baby. Hello. Hello. And you mustn't. Worry. I'll protect you from the power of the vein. Hmm. Foolish child. Foolish weak child. The grimoire and its bearer need to be destroyed. If you won't get your out of our way, we may as well take over your body. Oh, buddy. We can like this, we shall do the impossible. We shall become one with a true king. Doesn't look good. Quickly, everyone to me. This is the Grimoire's chance. Hmm. Yeah. Ah! We 
we are becoming one with him. We shall make him our new champion. Everybody, I'm going to burst the Grand Grimoire. Dare you. Ah. We did it. No, we didn't. Not quite. Are the vine dead? No. The great grimoire. Has no ether to absorb and is crumbling to dust. If it can't find any ether, does that mean that the Bane is still alive? It hurts. It's drained. Looks like it's not over. Hmm. It's still powerful enough to crush you like flies. You're nothing but mere humans. Mere humans. Again and again you destroy the world. And again and again, humanity and nature rebuild. They never give in. The, their, will to live, their will to live is never broken. You call them weak, but in truth, you fear them. The people fight beyond the limits of their own lives. He's right. You were alive when the Harbinger came and will still be so when he returns. All that you do, you do for yourselves. But look at the short lives of us humans. For countless generations, people have worked tirelessly towards a goal that they would never see in their lifetimes. They fought against a problem that would not affect them or their children. They gave their entire lives to a cause that was far in the future. They fought for later generations, despite setbacks, despite uncertainty. That is the strength of humanity. That is your downfall. Okay. Ah! I'm trying. Stop them. Billion won't be able to defeat them alone. Weaken them. They're taking roll again. Bury yourselves. The weapons of weapons of steel against the gods. I guess we'll make it work. Thing looks anything but god. Thing looks anything but godly. Ugh. I keep having hiccups. <laughs> that thing looks anything but godly to me. We should succeed then, right? If we don't... Ah, this world has so much to offer. You will not destroy it. Let's put some sense into these gods. With these fiends in our way, we have no chance to leave Eldria into a better future. Let's show them what we learned on our journey. You're right. <laughs> this may be our last battle together. We can do it, everyone. I believe in us. Let's win it then. Look at that ugly thing. Anyway. Ah. Okay. Yes. All right, we're bringing in bringing in uh Ezio. Power Pierce. Pet 
Battle Storm. Nice. Heal all. X slash. Gary. Ah. Ah. Kill him. Another vein appears. Oh no. Let me help you. Okay, that's cool. Fine, it's fine. Good, 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 good. All right. twice. There we go. It's a Gary. That's critical. Oh, gun spear. Nirvana, that's okay. It's all right. I know you get four attacks. That's that's cool. Into the world. No! She won't harm them. Nothing happened.
Oh, gun spear. That's okay. Seven ZS, thank you for the follow. Storm Spirit. Um, I'll break. Let's go for it. Heavenly Twin Tail Swallow. Yeah. Yeah, that's a good that's a good hit. What's it draining? I didn't even tell. Anyway. Ooh, nice kickback. Um Here we go. Duplicate. Oh no, not again. It's okay. Sorry. More vein up here. Ah. Oh. Uh, let's um. Yeah, uh, here, Yoko Gary. Sword wave. Oh. Nice. Uh, let's all break again. All right, we gotta we gotta heal up. Uh, we gotta heal. Uh, you know. Uh, power pierce. End of the world. All good. No. You shall live. <laughs> I knew that was a fake out. <laughs> I knew that was a fake out. That's uh, so good. I can't do any more than this. Now, you need to defeat the Bane. On your own. We will. We will. Don't you worry. We're getting closer. Please, Gary, again. Uh. I think we did it. That's it. Is it it? Is that it? Did we do it? Well done, Glenn. The failure is mine. But luckily you were here, as always. Back in control in a weakened vein you're locked inside me. You guys did a great job. Or I failed. You have triumphed. But I don't want to leave this world completely useless. Killian! Vane, die with me. I think just like Gwen wanted. 
power returns to you, Wine's chosen one. Live well. Forgive me. Forgive me. Is everyone all right? Is it, po is it possible? Have we won? Lynn. Will is mine now, so... To answer your question... Yes. We've won. Believe it. The Vader defeated? Life was broken. The Grand Grimoire destroyed forever. Finally. I mean, great job! We did it impossible! <laughs> All the fighting hasn't ended at last. Well, such a long journey. Thank you, everyone. What's happening? The door crumbles. And with it, this is significance. The city is no longer needed. It will fall apart. We better escape. We can warp out of there. I mean, we got the teleporter rock thing, whatever. Do you hear that? Oh no! The Dell! Not even a true king can sleep with all this noise. We survived the Bane and are now su we're supposed to fail, fail against a true king. We survived the Bane and now we're supposed to fail against a true king. Not if I can help it. Pass the Dell away with you. <laughs> you two seem to get along well. Forced my will on him. When? It's all right. Power is still quite new. Besides, it's not so easy to impose one's will on a true king. <laughs> ah. Well, Lynn. With the fiery calamity that, uh, that hovered over Valanda suddenly disappeared, the people burst into shouts of joy. They did not know what had happened yet, but they felt that they were finally free. Celebrations were held all throughout the country. Princess Celestia Valkyria of Taran was unanimously elected as Queen of a New Valandis. She was advised by a council represented from all corners of the land. The tyranny had ended. The unification between the people still had a long way to go. Disagreements between the countries did not magically disappear. The history of war could not be erased that easily. So the Queen and her council stood before an enormous task. They had hope, and therefore, they knew they would succeed in the end. Red Succubus? You? Seriously? It's true, people think her hair is some kind of elegant femme fatale. <laughs> I can't help it, I didn't pick the name. <laughs> Oh, hush, it's not that funny. And what do you intend to do now, Sergio? We'll travel throughout Aldria. The world is vast, and there is still much that I have not discovered from my first journey. What about you? You'll probably return with Lent. Take me with you. What? Please, make me your squire. Are you seriously serious? Yes, I want to see more of the world, and I want to help the people. I thought, there, I thought with all the nasty stuff I did back then, there was no saving me. But Quinn showed me otherwise. I can still change. Please, let me be a squire and help me make and help me make the world a better place. Dear Rob, I would lovingly love to. I can't take another sip. <laughs> what are you saying? Only a newborn can get drunk on this piss water. Let's head back to the art, your home city of Arcadia. And drinks proper wine. I could use a vacation, true. Now that my task is done. Get ready, everyone. He's coming. So, oh. <laughs> happy birthday, Amalia. You're all too much. This is not necessary. 
Thank you. Thank you so much. Brought since his regards. Hard to see anyway. Probably making preparations for the Order of Lenar. The Harbinger is waiting. Thras, are you you're leaving us? We don't have much time. You don't have much time. Your life is urgent. Do not save me. In two years at the latest, the pact will have taken my life. My future is the price I knowingly paid to receive the curse. We will still try. You saved our lives in Reyna's tomb, and now we will save yours. Our lives are connected by this curse. We'll find its roots and help you. Thank you, Briarn. Thank you. Thank you. Whatever he's doing, I'm sure it's the right thing. By the way, where's Glenn? He was just here. I'll see where he is. Enjoy the fresh air. There are a lot of people in there. You know I prefer being on my own. Besides, I haven't gotten used to this power yet. When are you leaving Volandis? Tomorrow morning. I'm boarding the first ship. Busy, aren't you? Are you going to be a second Gwaine now? No, I'll stay who I am. I've learned that Gwaine's way of doing things is not the right way. Can't use just use any means without remorse to achieve my goals. Agreed. I'll dedicate myself to vanquishing the harbinger once order is restored in Landis. With this power is with the power is queen. I'll strengthen the Lanar order again. Now where do you come from? Doesn't seem to be afraid. Oh, he's been coming here all day. I even gave him a name. Oh. Well, what are you calling him? Glenn. He has red hair like his bird like this bird's feather and is in love flying. So you know? Seems to be my ability. After all, I sense that Glenn was not Timothy as well. Only well, took his face to spare you sadness. Are you angry? It's certainly Glenn's own decision, right? His decision, huh? This is what Gwen's power feels like. Kind of scary. Use it wisely and don't make the mis they don't make the same mistakes I did. See Gwen's memories. To defeat the Harbinger with the help of the other true kings. Early eternal mission standing there before me. I have no doubt you will succeed. I have to go now. The vein inside me are dead. Now my soul will dissolve in the, in the maelstrom. Did you know that I had a pet bird? What? Why are you saying this now, of all times? I grew up in the slave town of Golgotha. You know that. A pile of garbage surrounded by high walls. My mother had a thing with the guards, so we were doing okay. She often got presents. At one point, she brought me a cage with a bird. He became my best friend. Then one day... Admin came to our house, and my mother sent me to the roof. Of course, I took the bird with me and we hid up top. However, I became afraid for him. He had nowhere to go in his tiny cage, so I opened it and told him to hide somewhere else. Somehow I thought he would come back. He flew up, higher and higher. He picked up wind and flew over the walls. As I wondered where he was going for the first time, I understood the concept of freedom. I also wanted to go where the bird flew. I also wanted to fly over every wall. But he became a Sky Armor pilot. People fear death and seek immortality. But after having lived so many lives, you can believe me on one thing. One life is more than enough. As long as you live it to the fullest. But I couldn't do that. I was weighed down with my burden for so long. Even when I was in a Sky Armor, I was never really free. I could never truly fly. Perhaps I do, really do have the, the most potential to handle Gwaine's powers, but I don't have the will to do it. I've had enough. 
What are you talking about? Not too late, Killian. We'll turn it around one more time. My new power, I will save you. You will become a new true king. Are you crazy? I only fail. Look where I ended up. We humans will have to make mistakes in order to grow. In the end, all that matters is the person that we become. I'm tired and at the end of my road. You, though. You still have your whole journey ahead of you. Learn from your mistakes and become the savior of this world. Do not cry. You're doing me a favor. I'll return to the maelstrom now. When? When we die, we have the potential to become anything we wish for. Part of us can be mammal, fish, or an insect. We can even become, become a part of the earth. Plant, a leaf, or even a tree. We can become a drop of water in the ocean, or... Did, are, did we just do a prestige? Or a grain of sand in the beach? We just did a prestige. Flat the star in the sky or a star in the night. If I could wish for anything, I wish that a little piece of me would be reborn as a bird. A bird that can spread its wings through the blue sky. Truly free. Flynn is a nice name for the bird. I should go now. We'll meet again. If not in this life, then the next. We will. What are you doing? Want to come with me? What? Did we just do a prestige? Dang. We did. What an effort to put on a fake face. Seems like my power hasn't fully awakened yet, Glenn. Thanks. Where's the brat? Gotcha. Leave me alone. What's the problem? She's a stowaway. Nothing that's bother you, sir. Help me. I'll pay for a ticket. You don't have to do that, sir. You will take the money. <laughs> I will take the money. Are you alright? Yeah. What's your name? June. And what are you doing here, June? I was told that there's a person on the ship that will take care of me. That's why I sneaked on here. Who is that supposed to be? The man with many faces. Who told you that? You ask a lot of questions, mister. Who's the man without a face? The man with the mask. Mask? Ha 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 That's so. The fate has accepted me. Well then, accompany me a little. You like the bird? Pay hey, a ticket for it too? Of course I did. A little too big for mere luggage. Strange, a bird that can fly travels by ship. You're right, it is strange. It's only here because of me. I didn't want to be alone. Now you have me. Right. Why don't we say goodbye to him together? Agreed, June? Agreed. Here you go. Here you go. Farewell, my best friend. Oh, he's fast. He's the fastest bird in all of Eldrea. Hmm. And that's Shane Echoes. And that whole ending sequence with the with. Like, they did a prestige, and they also... They also not, ripped off Terranigma as well. <laughs> Which, that was cool. I'm, I'm, I'm good with anything that, that pays reference to that. But, uh, yeah. Yeah.
Herb. In any case, yeah, good game. Good game. Like, you know, in some ways it gets a little too deep in its homages, but yeah. Hey, Mentally Numb, how you doing? Thank you for the GGs. There's a lot of stuff. There's a lot of post-game stuff and a lot of uh, a lot of other things that we can do too. But and a lot of new game plus stuff. Hey, the band's back together again. Wait, is that is that Victor? On stage? Oh, awesome. No. Oh. oh. Bassoon by Bassoonify. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Nice credit. <laughs> Bassoon by Bassoon Jew of Dallas. Was that... Was that Killian's sister? They're on the... Oh, they're back on the, uh... They're on the, the, the huge... have a fast forward at all so must be special thanks must be stat pets published by deck 13 goodbye oh okay yeah it was um crowdfunding as well okay yeah I noticed there there's like a kind of a graveyard area that kind of uh, references I guess Kickstarter backers or crowdfunding backwards. All right, post credits. We got the big post credits hook. Anything? It's fading. I think that's it. Oh no, there we go. The end.
Thank you. You're for, okay. Without you, this game. Okay, this is a uh, all Kickstarter folks. So or all crowdfunding folks. No, it's a world building, uh, world builder uh, funding. The one that uh, the one that a lot of tabletop games have started to use. Oh my! All right. I want to make sure there's nothing else after these credits before I wrap up. Yeah, thanks, thanks for everybody that hung out for this uh, for this game, and and we're around for the ending here and. Um, yeah, thanks to everybody that, um, was here. In case you're catching this on the VOD, thanks to everybody that was here, uh, previously. Um, I'm gonna be getting back to Crystal Project, uh, next stream, which is gonna be tonight. Might be a little late, but that's okay. It'll be 11 hours from now, so that's enough time to get some sleep. Yes. Wish there was a C for this. I just wish that hey Mac Mac Mac, how's it going? I just rolled I'm rolling credits now on uh Crystal Pro uh, not Crystal Pro Chained Echoes. Good game. Good game. Just wish I could... Ah. Oh my. And while you're here... I was I was lurking for a little bit of Catacomb 3D. What was the other game that you were playing? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Everybody, fo go follow that uh, rack clown car. I'm sure, they're good. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> but yeah, everybody definitely can follow Mac Mac Mac. Uh... Oh, also, Mac, a new one. There we go. Red Ocean starring... That's right. Starring Jack Hard. <laughs> yeah. We we up, we upgraded the less manly. Also, I got this in... Uh, on Better Twitch TV, I got a brand new long emote, too. Clush. So anybody that has BTTV, oh by the way, Better Twitch TV has just recently added uh, long emotes, and you can always do animated emotes. So now better than better than you ever could with Franker Face, you can do long animated emotes. Oh, thank you, thank you. Thanks, Mac. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All those bots by Flush. I got that from the uh, from the Famitsu ad for uh, Rad Racer, aka Highway Star. Oh wow! It just really started up another another reel of credits. Okay, this is gonna be a while. 
Yeah. Bot hammer. Yeah. Get him. Oh my. Can I... Can I hit escape? No. Yeah, this is all like, like, uh, crowdfunding backer credits, because they funded this on World Builders, I think. I think it's the rate where they funded it. Hold on. Um... Oh no, it was Kickstarter. They raised... They raised 130,000 euros back then. And, uh, back in... I guess it was... Uh, it was sometime in 2020. When they started doing the crowdfunding for it. But yeah, this was originally supposed to come out in, uh... Okay. Oh no, this was originally... They started funding on this in... I think it was... Yeah, it was... They started funding on this back in 2019. Back in March of 2019, and, uh, they originally had a target of September 2021, uh, but, yeah, they ended up, yeah, they, it came out in December, so there were some delays, that's okay. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Well, I think Premiere 2 is still on. Is Premiere 2 still on? Hold on. If Premiere 2 is still on playing Chain Echoes, we're going to raid into Premiere 2. Yeah, he's still playing Chain Echoes, so... No spoilers. I don't have to tell. I shouldn't have to tell anybody that. But, uh, yeah. Oh my gosh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The, the games are not really good. Uh, I mean, there's some, uh, there was some unevenness with the writing, but, you know, that's whatever, whatever. Um, turned out really good. Turned out really great. Worthwhile if you like the 90s RPGs. Mail is also on. Mail's on late. Yeah, more. Shout out to Mel plays games. Who's working on Monster World Four? Jeez, this might be the last tier. They should have. They should have. Uh, they should have. They should have. Uh, At least given this uh, another row of credits, rather, or another column of credits. Maybe made this space, uh, maybe, you know. It's something about the spacing? It's okay. It's okay. It's a rat clown car raid, that's right. Yeah. 
That that works too. Oh my gosh. Oh. So much. You're not right. I think this might be the last tier of credits. I hope. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, they could have uh they could have uh, figured it out, I think. That's okay. That's okay. They had they had a lot of funding. Hopefully there's not going to be another tear after this. Just don't know why there's not a key to skip this. Or to sort of, you know... Like you can't even press a button or hold a button here. Yeah. Oh, there we go. I had to actually... Actually, I had to... Uh, you have been placed before the final boss battle. Receive your game to receive a completed save file tag. Jeez, okay. Okay.